focus on him and no and no 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 i made one comment because somebody again referenced my poetry you're wrong i love to talk about other shit jesus christ i'm not that interesting this you're right let's go back it's true conversation. moving on that was cool but yeah I, mean, I would say, well, you can also look at Shelly. Like, that retard. Johnny, fuck you. You're going to be my nemesis, okay? Jesus Christ. That retard. No. Look at Chad. Said, that retard. And ugly. That retard. Like, come on. I don't think I've ever met you before. Hi, I'm Hannah. What's your name? Hi, Hannah. Uh, my name's Alex. My daughter's name is Hannah, so I, I like Hannah's extra. <laughs> yeah, no worries. So, how, how do I pronounce it? Alexicon or just Alex? It's Alexicon. Alexicon is the. Or just Alex or X, anything, whatever. Mm -hmm. Just wanted to make sure I didn't, you know, fuck that up. Yeah, apparently I have a large number of mental disorders, but this is like a group full of therapists who's like here to help me by talking mad shit. It's great. It's hilarious. You, you think we're lying on you, though, but it's true. That sounded uh, that sounded like a therapist. I would definitely listen to that voice. Just struck me as being super educated and reasonable. But thanks for the little troll. Hey, I, and once again, I would, like to, I would like to thank you for jumping into uh, voice chat to make this all about you. Do come again, <coughs> Molly. You, bo I, I, Molly. I got again. I got no problem. You, you are to me. I mean, you should stick with other stuff. Just talking shit. Someone brought me up. I was quiet and working for hours on, a, on great shit. I happened to hear yeah, my name. Yeah, it was just a little comment. I wasn't trying to start an entire conversation. Well, then maybe if Molly didn't talk best, about me and that other dude didn't talk about me, this wouldn't happen. This conversation like a wrecking ball. <laughs> it's beautiful. I miss you guys. I'm a wrecking baller. Too hot, honey. It's too hot. Katy Perry is my girlfriend. Wait, I thought I was your girlfriend. That song was weird. Well, I have moved on. So, how did you get wrecked by uh, DD, Johnny? What's he arguing? I need a picture. Oh, God, do I want to listen to it? Shit, it's recorded? Fuck yeah, let's go. Yep, do it. Yeah. <laughs> well, you said you, he was going to like play some. I'm just saying, everything that happens in this room, if anybody misses it, can be played back. That's really nice. No, I'm responding to general chat. I'm, I had Discord open in one window oh. while I'm doing something on it. Oh, I thought something was supposed to be playing. Yeah, Johnny, Johnny's finding a, a video of uh. this guy talking to Didi or something. I don't know. Oh, see, Hannah, darling, um, Alex, for lack of a better his, his gig is to, he goes into servers while he's writing magical poetry and you know, gracing us with said poetry. Likes to sit in and listen and record uh, servers. Uh, I can actually, can I, I really quickly? I, I am recording my own shit. I'm not here to record Molly like talking about me or anybody else talking about. Are you about recording me right now? Every, like multiple people are. I, mean, I think are. I should just respond and chat. That are really are you recording me right I'm now? I'm not sure. I had it. I had it. Just on the trip. Let's go. Yeah, I'm asking you right now. Are you recording I, I, me? I, yeah, I have uh, all like 20 years, every second I spend on the internet on the record. So yeah, I'm recording me and you're there and, and so are multiple people and it gets streamed and people monetize too. This dude is crazy, Dana. Nothing yeah, I... Why, is, why is that... Uh, what is... Why? 
for record for re for recording. It's, it could be a matter of, you know, just not being impolite that you might want to let people know that you're recording. Tom them. told, uh, we talk, this has been talked about a million times. I mean, Tom, this is Tom's room. A lot I of, know Tom is recording. I don't mind if Tom records, right? Because I have a relationship with Tom. I know if I said something on recording that I don't want in public, I could talk to Tom about it. We can have a rational discussion, right? I don't know you. I, okay, I didn't say we couldn't do that. If you say something, if anyone's... I don't know you. So it would be nice and considered very polite if you were to at least say, hey, just letting you know, if you're going to be in a conversation with me, I'm recording. Well, I mean, that, right? yes. You're, so you're, I can decide whether or not I, you have a recording of me saying something. Absolutely. But I, that's why I said, like, that's part of the reason I said that, you know, in this room, like, of course, you can you can get instant replay. It's good to be able to go back. I was commenting on the recording itself. I mean, I didn't just say, hey, I'm recording. I just said, listen. Someone else mentioned that you're recording. Okay. You no, I. I, I, I mean, somebody else mentioned that you're recording. I mean, the recording says I'm like it is of me speaking out. I mean, he <laughs> he, he already linked he already linked okay. the YouTube channel like so you could see that there's actually like recordings like that. Right, it's, I know that now because other people in the room spoke up and told me that you were going to be recording I and mean, that you're recording, or at least you know in I mean, chat as well. well I so mean, you didn't tell me, hey, just to let you know I'm recording you right now. Other people had to let me know that that's what you're doing. I'll have to check the record to see if I didn't say something first, because I'm pretty sure I just kind of brought attention right, to it. The easiest thing would have been no. to, hey, hi, Hannah, nice to meet you, just to let you know I'm recording this conversation. Uh, that, to everyone who I talk to here, that's, I mean, I could do that. It's it's a little weird. It's, yeah, but, that's that's probably a good idea. That's probably a good idea. I'll just idea. change. I mean, I I'll change my name. That you're recording me for under, for no apparent reason. But, I'm not. Well, you I mean, do. How, well, there's no reason that's apparent to you, and I am sorry for that. I mean, I'm not doing it to you. I've been doing it for a, a lot of hours here. And no, I, don't, I don't give a shit. You're doing it to me now. You're, you're doing it to me now. So I'm saying, if you want to be weird and just start recording, like there's no content being produced here, right? There's nobody getting in a yelling match or something. Well, you, I mean, you are you are you are basically saying that I'm doing this with no apparent reason because you don't see an apparent reason. I've been doing it for 25,000 hours. Yeah, unless. Unless you want me to somehow infer why, what kind of reasons you would have other than being like somebody who's just interested in recording every little facet of their life. I mean, I, you could be that type of person. Sure. I don't really see why I have to be a participant in that unless you are kind enough or polite enough to let me know ahead of time that you're doing that. I, mean, I am sorry. It is it is really hard to let people know before you talk to them as far as I've experienced. like. Um, I, I record because I've been inventing things for years, and what, like after I got about five things, I realized I should keep track of the process. I'm not a fucking creep. I'm not. I've never fucked with anybody. I mean, Gus, I wrote a poem to. That <laughs> I never suggested you were a creep, right? It's not like I've, I've said something in here that's like sexually explicit or, or it could be skewed in such a way. I'm just saying that's incredibly impolite, at least, right? That as I'm introducing myself to you. You don't let me know right away, hey, just for your own sake, I'm recording. Because I know Tom at any moment in time can be. And like I mentioned before, I have a relationship with Tom, right? So there, there's no ambiguity there. But there's ambiguity between the two of us because this is the first time I've met you. Would you agree? Yeah, and I and I apologize. It, 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 I apologize for okay, not... Okay, that's fine. You apologize. That's fine. You apologize. Now, now I'm aware I'm recorded. Now, Johnny, if you want, you can play the video. Dude, wait, is he playing that video? I always get muted. Listen, sir, I had, a, I had a discussion and a debate for about 45 minutes to an hour just because he was an atheist, and he didn't get muted because he didn't behave like a jerk. Well, I mean... And, he, and, and, and I will add, he completely disagreed with me. After one, after one, he disagreed with me. He didn't get muted because he wasn't a jerk, so I'm asking you a simple question. How is it dangerous to acknowledge the existence of God? Did you read the rest of it? I'm saying when you fill your... Uh, I'm not really interested in the full text. I already answered. Why is it dangerous for somebody to acknowledge that God exists? Let me rephrase the question for you. Why is it dangerous for somebody to acknowledge that there is something that is ultimate, absolute, non-dependent, that possesses the property of personhood, and is the origin point for all, all derivational facts? Why, is that, why would that be dangerous?
seconds, you have two minutes, three minutes, uninterrupted, explain to me why somebody acknowledged that, 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 that there is God outside the universe. Yeah, dude, I don't, listen, we're not going to do this. You can talk on microphone. I need, I need a minute or two just to talk with you without you taking the sovereign reins of the conversation and derailing me. Sir, as a, as a man. Looking at my clock right now, you have two minutes, that's no, I'm saying I, I have to be able to speak before you can start to inquisit me. That's why I'm writing, because you won't... You Hold on, I'm trying to get this. It won't questions. switch off. Hold on. What the hell? I, just don't, I can't hear you. Hold on. Speak here. Hello? Shit, I'll shut this off. What's up? I already said clock. We're going to start. What time are we crashing their getaway? Whenever you want. Um, I'm kind of, I'm doing something right now. Like, whenever you want. Just send, tell me whatever you want and I'll do it, okay? It's not about whatever I want. It's what your dad expects. He's, he's totally fine. He You're you're a good guest. Uh, uh, so whatever's fine. Let, let me get back to you in a few minutes, okay, please? This is important. Whatever you want. Food. Okay, whatever you want, just let me know. I'll talk, first I'll talk to you in a few answer. minutes. Okay? Wait. I'm not going to... The first thing I say... Is not going to be a direct response to your dictatorial question. Like, I'm not having I'm not having a debate with somebody who's also the mediator. Are you fucking serious? I'll type. I'm fine. I write fast as shit. My my book is done and it's brilliant shit. I would love to work with you, Darth, but it's been impossible so far. <laughs> That is a funny joke. <laughs> I get it. What? I think, honestly, you must literally spend too many hours with idiots every day. It must be something like that that just causes you to look down on us all. Like, we're all fucking dumb. Like, we're all fucking dumb. We're not. Is Tom is Tom aware that he's doing that? Yes, Tom's aware. I had a talk with Tom and Ray the other night when none of the. No, 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 no. Hey, wait, 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 wait! Just for clarification, I'm I'm talking to literally anybody else. But you. So does no, no, no. anybody know if if Tom knows? Besides Alex, nobody else knows. Right. I just find it interesting that. It's one thing when you're engaging in debate and conversation and you're recording, but when you just come in really not saying much and just record for hours. But do I do that? Like, why? I'm recording my text, my writing. All my writing is recorded. Oh, as, fucking, I don't care. I don't care about anything you say. Okay. So ju just because I'm curious and, and I want to kill myself. So you're aware that you are in full control of what you type in the general chat, right? Or in whatever text chats you have access to, right? Yeah. Okay. So given that you have control over what you can type and what you can do. So when you start recording what you're typing and shit like that, you do know that other people, like other sentient creatures, are also texting and doing shit, right? Like, you're not some solipsist or anything like that. Right. Okay. I mean, I, obviously, so, it was friendly here, according, like, Tom, the way Tom talked to, like, it was something that, he said anyone here, can, I'm not trying to stay here unless things get super positive. I won't do this. I have no interest in 
broadcasting you. I've just been here and I've been writing a lot and that's it. I'm not trying to capture you. I'll leave if nobody becomes cooperative and keeps thinking I'm a fuck like a horrible person. I'll, there's a ton of places to go. It's kind of fun I, here. I didn't I know, but you're 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 jumping off the bandwagon. Hold on. I'm not I'm not going like that deep. I'm just saying like if there's something that is so like groundbreaking, so creative, so innovative, if you can just take that right? You can open up notes or, or, or notepad in the computer, right? And just paste it there. Right? Or you can text it to yourself or email it to yourself or whatever. You don't, why do you, why do you think you need to record everything you're typing? If, if the only thing you're really interested in is making sure that you, you, in case you say something brilliant, you, you, you have it on record. Well, that, I mean, that is part of it. I mean, it, I could say, could you at least presume that maybe it's not certain that I'm doing it for a shitty reason? Is that possible? Can we get to that? I never, asserted, I never asserted that. I only went by what you told me, which is the reason why you're recording is so that you have a record of what it is that you're typing in, in chat, right? That, that doesn't say anything about whether you're being shitty or anything like that. That's the only reason that I know of right now. So that's what I'm working with. Right. Yeah, most of it. I mean, there are times when I forget. Like, I've been in here a lot for a couple of days. So there's definitely times when I am sitting here recording and I walk away from the computer or something and I forget. But I'm not, like, trying to sign into this room when I'm not interacting with y'all at all. Like, it's only when I'm here with you and if people want to get rid of me, whatever. I'm sorry that I – but Tom did seem to say that it was fine. And, and I'm not – like, I haven't even monetized any of these things. This is a new YouTube channel, brand fucking new, and it's designed to possibly be monetized. I'd love to – if revenue comes at some point and, and like – I'm working with any of you, of course. I think that it's appropriate to figure out a fair system of, of royalties. I think 20 of us could create something much whoa, better whoa, than whoa, I could whoa, create whoa, whoa, by whoa, whoa, myself. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm not talk I don't care if you monetize your channel. I don't care what th that that is not at all what I'm talking about. So what what you decide to do with whatever you put up on your YouTube channel, honestly, the only thing I see with that is that's between you and Tom, right? Because Tom is the server owner. So if he has some objection against it, I'm sure he's going to take that up with you. If he doesn't, obviously not. Whatever you want to upload, that's to your business. I don't, I don't care, right? I'm doing the only reason why I took uh, exception to it when I first introduced myself to you is because ordinarily I don't like being recorded, right? But given that I am in this space, I am aware of at least two individuals that would be recorded, right? And two more should the uh, first two not be available. So I know exactly who they are, and I have a relationship with them. So like I said before, if there's something that I take exception to me saying, being in the public sphere, I can just message them and we can have a conversation about it, right? I don't know you. So I take it that most people, when <laughs> they're engaging with you, they're not thinking that you're recorded, right? At least not in this room. Most people would think like Tom or somebody else is recorded. So you having that is kind of weird to me which is why I'm inquiring as to why you do it. That's it. I, mean, I don't give a fuck about anything else. I mean, I do, I do it. I started doing it because I, I write and say a lot of very unusual, like unusual things. And I, and I started finding intellectual equity and I don't, I smoke weed. I don't like try to like develop a, a great, great long-term memory. It's just, it, I feel like it, it allows me to keep my mind light. And I think there is a lot of profound work over the last 25,000 hours. I've never, like I, you other don't have to live the videos, if you claim that they're for yourselves, why are they all public? Well, this, this is a new, this is a new channel. Yeah. You didn't address what she said. Why don't you just use notes? Well, when I actually, well, because I, what I will do if it's good, if I write something good, I write it in Messenger because I'm actually writing to the context of all of you in the community. I am writing. Sometimes if it's real, if it's long and it's really good, I will just cut and paste it so I don't annoy you. And then I put it into a word processor. I photograph it and I put it into a series of, you know, I don't know, 100,000 something screenshots. I am writing. I will put funny, like, tr like community shit. If I just have a comment or Johnny's talking shit to me, like I'll just write some shit back. But I do a lot of writing. It's just this is the community where uh, it was okay to record, and I've been doing it anywhere. There's only a couple good rooms I have where everyone's whoa, recording whoa, whoa, friendly. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, stop right there. Wait, wait, stop. Did you just say that you were doing it anyway before you found out that it's okay to record? No, yeah, I was doing it twenty like twenty years ago. I, I'm uh, yes, I well, no, actually, here I knew no, they no, told no, me. You, you said in the context of this room, you were recording before you knew it was okay. 
I'm not. I, no, I don't. That, I don't know that that's true. I would assume that I knew Tom was a streamer and that he done uh, like the Darth Dawkins shit. And I just would assume, like, if I'm seeing all that stuff, I think I would assume at first, no matter what, that this that obviously there's recordings. Maybe he was only doing it to Dawkins and he never recorded you guys. I didn't see all of his videos, but the impression I got was that you're 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 missing you're missing my point. Look, like I said to you, and I'll say it again. I know that when I'm in this room. Tom is going to record and a handful of other people may or may not be recording me. May or may not be recording me right now, right? I don't have a problem with that. That's my, I consented to that being in this room that those select individuals have permission from the server owner to do that, right? And I, the reason, the reason why I don't mind, ordinarily I would, the reason why I don't mind is because I have a relationship with them, right? So like, like I said, if I have something that I take exception to being in the public sphere, I can bring it up with them, right? So that, that has nothing to do with what I'm asking you. So you took it upon yourself to start recording the server before you found out that it was okay to record. Is that, that was that not what you said just a minute or two ago? Well, I'll say this. I went into another server, to, to give you context very quickly, I went into another server yesterday, or one I've been in for a long time, and I just went in there, right? I am recording the internet wherever I go, so I just went into the server Usually, I will like say something within a half. I try to say something within a half hour. Like I don't want to just be like, "Hey, I'm Mr. Recorder." But I'll be like, "Listen, I record shit. If I cannot record in conversations with you, then we don't talk anymore. There's not even like, there's I I just will not talk with people the way they act on the internet off the record. Like part of it's that I think I say good things, but I get brutally fucking savaged as a mentally ill piece of shit every day. And I think I've created something great. So I think for posterity, if I'm right, which I could be, showing them like what it's actually like to dedicate your life to something really bright and then and then and walk into places like the internet where everybody looks down on you it could be educational because people are really mean to me you're the most reasonable here's the thing here's the thing here's the thing you just like to the, and and everyone records right and i've always gone into a server assuming someone's recording right. going coming back from g plus days here's the thing that's really weird you said, you know, you're recording it, the content and hoping to monetize it. So, and, and then what's what I find really interesting is that, you know, you say that you're inventing and you're creative when really all you're doing is fucking sucking off of us for your content. You're not creating anything. You're simply just recording it and, and using that for, for your, for your you know, hopefully monetary gain, which is pretty kind of fun. I haven't, I haven't monetized oh, anything. Money. I certainly... That's like pulling a McRae. I, I, I haven't... Sorry? That's like pulling a Steve McRae. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. I mean, if you look at, if you look at all, the most money that Tom's gotten from his channel, I mean, it is literally just start hey, no, no, Dawkins. No, no. Start no, Dawkins. No. It's some other no, person... No, 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 no. He's sucking yeah. off some other crazy yeah. person, right? I mean, it's just the way it kind of goes. Yeah. Like, but here's the gig. <laughs> we are part of this community, and we understand. You're you're just somebody who's coming in and saying, "Oh, uh, here I can lose count these people." And I'm not lose calling really anyway. Other than wanting to talk about how fucking you're the master of the universe and post, you know, pony shit to make fun of other people, you really. Don't add anything to this community yet. You're fucking sucking off of it. I mean, the record said the records are clear. The number of words I've spoken, exactly what those words are. I've definitely added something to the community, even if it annoys the shit out of you. Okay. By that argument, I'm gonna post penis. I'm just gonna have penis on repeat all the way down the chat as many times. I'm just gonna have a block of text that the only word that's written there is penis. Now, technically speaking, I've contributed to the server. Dude. It's not really what she's getting at, is she? No, and I have, I have. This channel happened to coincide. I just, I got to five thousand videos on my last channel, which was not for monetization. It was for storing five thousand videos on, on YouTube's massive server farm for free, which is a great service they provide to people who actually create large archives. That's all I was doing. I got to a new channel right. At, Right about when I came here, and I did not come here on purpose, I'd already st I'd already started working on the new channel, which I did set up six years ago, but only put a video of my... Wait a minute, wait a minute. You, you did not come here on purpose? What, did you fucking trip, stumble, no, I... and fall into our server? <laughs>
I didn't come here to get savage, dude. I've heard funny things, right? Sometimes, yeah, you walk into Tom's and some funny shit happens, and I get to laugh. But so. again, what I'm asking you is, you said you didn't come here on purpose, so was it like a fucking slip and fall into the server? What yeah, I, I slipped and I bashed my head on the button. That's what happened. That's what I meant. Oh, that, that, I agree. I, I agree that may have happened. And um, also one other thing, you need to put it on the headset because you're causing echo, and you've been told that before. How long was I doing it before someone said something this time? Because a lot of rooms, it doesn't echo. It's, it's whenever, been happening. I've just been ignoring it. Yeah, whenever you and someone else are talking at the same time, it echoes whatever they're saying twice. Okay, just please, in the future, if I don't get kicked out, tell me. I'm putting headphones on right now. Thank you. I, and I am because sorry. Here's the truth of it. The truth of it is, I have a really shitty voice, and the last thing I want to hear is my own voice. Thank you. No, you don't stop. Same. I, just, I still haven't heard like quite an, an explanation or, or an answer to why is it that he feels like he has to record everything. Because he's not delineating or he's not making some sort of separation between like, oh, I'm only grabbing screenshots or of what I'm texting or whatever. He's capturing everything, right? Audio, visual, text, all that shit. So what... I don't understand what the purpose. Like, he hasn't explained well, I, what the purpose of that is. Like, he said for record keeping, but I can think of like a much less taxing way to keep a record of retarded shit that I post, right? Like, yeah. It just seems to me a lot of work to, oh. just to upload on YouTube, which means he's keeping a record not for privacy sake, right? Not for his own collection. He's doing it for the public access. I have multiple Why? copies off YouTube. That's in case both, like, the storage locations with hard drives burn down. I have, of course, it's for myself and for my grandkids. YouTube happens to be there and is a giant dinosaur with massive video storage capacity. You're saving, you're saving the recordings from this server? I, no, I, I have 25,000 hours. I have 20... I have 25,000 hours of, of, of shit. Okay, I've done maybe 100 here. And I'm sorry, maybe 20 of them. I wasn't even, like, talking, talking at all. But I, I'm not going to talk all the time. Sometimes I sit back and I'm a passive participant. And in an hour, I hear shit and I'll come in and I'll talk. I, I have 100 out of 25,000 hours Why from here. Public? Well, the new ones are public because it's drama as fuck. Everyone's been, like, shitting. I've been writing raps. Like, it's like the internet. Like, a brilliant person, which I, I used to be. I You're used really? to be. I'm stupid now. Every second, every minute. And when not, it's not about you, when it's not even talking about your... When we're just having regular conversation, you're recording it. Why? I mean, you, I can take you, if you wanted to, which would... Oh, you're promoting yourself. I can take you to what I did last night, which was a ton of fucking work. We don't want to promote ourselves. The fuck are you... What's your problem? Okay. Okay. What? what? You seem, you seem to be... You I'm trying, I'm trying. You seem to be of the mind... Hold on, no, no. You seem to be of the mind that everyone's reasons or, or for recording or not being recorded are similar to what you intend, right? So if you're doing YouTube shit and recording what we're doing in the Discord for YouTube monetization or whatever, you're assuming that everybody else has some sort of stake in that YouTube monetization. We don't, right? We're only inquiring as to why you're doing it in the first place. I already gave you my personal exception to being recorded by you, right? Because you're a stranger to me. So I don't know what purpose... I, I have to take your word for it. I don't know what purpose you're using it for, you know? Other people may have their own reasons for why they find it a little bit suspicious or shady or whatever, why you're recording. But for right now, we're just trying to figure out, like, why you personally record everything. So that's including text chat, that's including voice conversations, whatever channel you're in. And then you're deciding to upload it publicly for view on YouTube. And... At the same time, you're not talking about monetizing videos that, of course, I would share a certain percentage of that monetization with the community. I said that. Oh, oh, come on. This is so annoying.
what they're trying to do. I'm just saying that I the, mean, the, have record, I the record, the record, have I done? The record shows like pretty vicious fucking like responses. To me. I'm just saying that's what the record shows. I'm not saying I didn't say some horrible poetry that killed people. I'm but saying the that the record, record shows, shows from the very beginning, from the very beginning, because I can't play my memory to you. How can I do that? I, you okay. have your own opinions about shit. If there's not an objective record, people can say, no, I fucking like literally in the beginning, it started out people being like, that's my idea. And I'd be like, first of all, it's not my idea. But it's definitely not yours, right? Like I'm. I'm See, an here's the thing again. You just came in. You, you really. I'm gonna be honest with you. You're not a member of our community. You just come in to fucking suck off us and, and hope. What to have I sucked? What have I sucked? I've been attacked. That's it. I bet it's been like Darth okay, Dawkins yeah, attacking see, I, everyone. I know, I know, I know. I know. What it's, did you it's, contribute, it's Molly? What did you contribute? It, it's it's hard. It's hard to be a victim twenty four seven. Who's gonna pay me advertising uh, money it, to listen to you talk shit about me? Probably people, actually, because the internet's dumb as fuck. Okay. You've never said so, anything except talking shit to me. You've never said anything except questioning me like I'm inherently a piece of shit who walked into this computer to fucking rape, into this server to rape everybody. It's so stupid and dark. That's not true. It's so dark. Actually, uh, the time before you came in, we were quite cordial to each other. Once. Until you came in this last time and decided to, you know, fucking what? post dissertations of your, what you like to call, poems and raps. And they're, they're just I words. asked you to maybe post that in another server so you're not clogging up the stream of conversation on text you chat. Don't, you don't, and you don't. that's what. Okay, I'm still talking. I know you can hear me. I, I know, but so, it sounds I garbage. Said, okay, yeah, still talking, still talking. Yeah, so after I said that to you, you became quite pissy and indignant about it and decided to have a route. So that's basically what started you know, the bantering between you and I. And I still hold to it even though bb said you know block him and and you know everyone has a right well yeah you do have certain inalienable rights in our server and i don't think that should be one of them and just for um, clarification i haven't insulted you right i didn't say that you're creepy i didn't say that you've said that about you or that people have said about you i haven't insulted you called you stupid or anything like that i've simply been honest with you about your reasoning and how it's not uh coming through clearly right like, i can't rationalize what you think uh, the some shared intent that we all have with your content right so i'm trying sure. to get you to bridge that connection that's all uh, i'm not I mean, insulting you in any way i mean if anyone if someone like you act like i'm not i don't want a lot of time i'm not trying to get into this microphone like this but i'm saying if someone like you actually were to have a conversation with me and and people that uh, that sound like they kind of really dislike me would not speak up and interrupt and, and, and add shade to the conversations, I probably could do a pretty decent job of convincing you honestly that I'm more than a halfway decent person. There's no negative intent. Like, I'm not, I've never tried to hurt anyone. Like if, I've used a video from the past a few times when people said something and I made them laugh their asses off when they realized they were wrong. I've never gone after anyone. I have 25,000 hours. I'm not a mentally ill person. Like, I'm bipolar fucking barely. Like, barely, like a one. Like, there's nothing seriously wrong with me. I just am different, and people are mean on the internet, and then I, I react because I'm kind of naked, and I start, and I get really passionate. And yeah, I attack M Molly back, and I attack Gus for just jumping in before he could possibly have understood what Can was I just, being said. Uh, I, I, I just to, say... Uh, oh, go ahead. I, I was just going to say that what you just said about being barely bipolar or whatever, just the other night you were talking about how you were extremely mentally ill. What? You literally said the words. I'm yes, yes. Do you, you do, can you understand the tone of a person? Try. That's why. That's why I have a record. That's one of the reasons I have a record. Because if I said it, anyone would realize that it was fucking sarcastic. Anyone would realize that, except for you, you heard it and you didn't and you realize. Said, it. And it's recorded, and the tone is recorded, times, and any person the same thing can check. Multiple times. And you think I really meant that? Like, I, like that? Like, I'm, I'm super mentally ill. You really think that's okay, a serious so I, thing? So are we supposed to? Okay, you just said what you said just now in the very same tone. So you am I supposed right. to disbelieve yes, that? Yes, I'm saying also? it's, I'm saying it sarcastically. Also, I'm super mentally ill. I'm so fucking crazy. That's what I believe. I'm a one or I'm one or a one point five bipolar. That's like it. I'm a so, little uh, bit. This is dumb. So I, are I you guys psychotherapists? Uh, hang on, bro. I just want to say, like, a lot of people are. are shitting on you here i feel like i gotta at least do a little bit of white knighting if nobody else is going to uh i'm not going to be among those who who, uh, who don't think you're part of the quote unquote community or whatever you know whoever whoever can sit around here taking all this shit for long enough i think uh, qualifies so i i find you interesting and eccentric and interesting i guess in that you're eccentric 
And, uh, you know, I'm fine with listening to things you have to say and your poetry and all that stuff. I, I don't have a problem with it. I think uh, the shitting on you is just like standard operating procedure here for, I guess, what people consider noobs. I wouldn't take it too personally. Have you I don't have a problem with you either. What hazing is. No, I it, don't even think I've been hazing him, actually. Well, yeah, there, the meanest. there's a Such few days history to hazing. And yeah, and I and most of this is me reacting sort of passionately because I've be, I've be, I'm not I'm not a defensive person. I'm an offensive person. You say some shit to me, I feel it and I react. That's almost everything you know about me is that I'm like emotionally quite naked. That's it, really. And that I'm I talk fast, and that I rhyme sometimes. There's not a lot you actually know. Well, you came in and you know like you asked if everybody wanted to hear you rap, and we all pretty much said no. And then you rap, and you were. Nah, two people said. Two people. Asked, two two people said. Two people did but, say but, no. But nobody said yes. No, nobody was like asking you for more. Nobody was. And then when people gave you criticism, you just dismissed them as being haters. And when, you, and when all you say, when all you say is that's shit poetry, and the words have come out fast enough, like that you do, have not parsed the fucking concepts yet. Yeah, I'm gonna think no, you didn't. You did. Gus is not that we, fast, dude. Gus is fine. Gus is funny. Just think He's that not... we aren't capable of comprehending your rap, but that I'm sorry, fast? it's that not as out of the world as you think it didn't is. Didn't say it's out of the world. To interrupt hardcore and say that's like the biggest garbage piece of shit. To to derail like eight you know, lines. You know it's what? just fucked. It's just fucked. That's you the internet. This motherfucker is serious. That's, that's the what? risk you take. That's the risk you take when you come into a server full of people and tell them your poetry when they didn't ask for it. It's the risk you take, and if you want to be an artist in the world, you need to get a thicker skin when it comes to being criticized about it. Okay? I'm fine with and it. I just I just wrote back. Server. I just wrote back. I'm not who I'm not a rapper. I just I just responded to somebody this like doing a something. Poetry server. I didn't. So nobody said it is a poetry server. Ray Ray did some funny shit. We could, like there's fan art. There's different things that actually go on here. If you want to, like, keep it in your own chat, I'm sure no one will care, but, like, don't take over the room with it. I, I, my, the total time I've spent reading anything creative is literally, like, 92 seconds. The amount of time I've responded First to... impressions matter. You've also, like, spammed the first chat impression was we were lot talking, we were talking stuff about writing that a book. doesn't make sense. To, it, a lot of stuff I say chat, does not make sense to a lot of people a lot of the time. conversations going on in chat. So it's, um, a distraction from... I understand. The chat that I normally see, I'm sorry, like, I like you guys, but the chat in chat is, is like, usually small as fuck. If you want to ban me for not talking you small might, in chat, you chat, might not you care for the chat, chat, but us talking in the chat care about the chat. And, and for and you to come in, only... spew random poetry, and not care about the conversation going on sucks for the rest of us actually having a conversation in chat. I mean, the mic is and also it's trash. Kind of rude. <laughs> I have multiple mics, and I'm trying to get out of the house. Sorry, I don't even. Fuck, uh, you know. Can you guys believe how mean Hannah was being? I know, I'm just. No one said Hannah was being mean, but it did sound like, hey, I don't know like, you, and that means I think you might. Literally worse than Darth Dawkins ever could be. It's, just, <laughs> it's upsetting that we let this person into our server. I, I'm sorry, man. I should have never. We're come a family back. here. Hannah. I'm here to bring you all down. Fuck Excuse me, mother, family. mother Molly, please protect me from Hannah. <laughs> oh, well, fuck, penis, mother, I mother. think the, uh, the idea is that he's, he's like, he seems crazy. To you, so, I, I'm sure, I, okay, I seem crazy to you. And and a, and a number of people. Stop over talking to you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I know, it's, my issue is not with the crazy. My issue is just with your content sort of taking over everything a lot of the times. I like, agree. Do your, do your thing, but moderation. Like, moderation. He's handling it well, though, to Tom. He's not, like, powder kegging. I, I think you'll be okay. Dude. I'm I'm not black powder, dude. I'm not gonna explode. I'm fucking white powder, yo. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm sorry. I just don't attack me, and I'll be a normal dude. Jesus, maybe I'll chat a little bit extra. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we wish you it's all, uh, schizophrenia work. No, that's not. Funny. Funny. Yuri, are you fucking serious? Wait, oh my god, wait, I got that uh, frontier man vibe. I don't really like interacting <laughs> with these types of people. <laughs> <laughs> so, one of the takeaways is you probably shouldn't spam so much in chat. Try not it's to not spam. conversations. Get a new mic. 
How do you derail a fucking conversation? That's crazy, dude. There's like, ha ha, yes. What? Like, you write enough of those and the whole conversation disappears. Like, it's, a, it's, it's text that's actually typed. It's not derailing. You can't even interrupt chat. You can't scroll one inch is, because someone like, wrote something. Someone, when someone posts something, right? You, like, you read it and then that might be distracting, right? And obviously, if you're gonna like keep interjecting, that the distractions mount up and mount up, and it's a, t- a toll on attention. You also don't only type; you talk constantly. I don't know why you're acting as if you're only typing in chat. When people say chat, they're talking about voice, voice chat and text chat. Most everything I've said has been a response, though. There's very little original anything. It's just responding. No, in the past, you have babbled for long periods of time about things that had no connection to the topic, or only like rhyming connections to the topic they weren't substantive they weren't valuable and people got frustrated with it so they started being mean to you that's um, what happened fine that's i, ha- a, I have a, a, the conflict i have a different perspective right i mean again it's part of the reason i guess i i feel more secure in, in myself because i can anytime i can always go back and see what was actually happening and was i like how often did i interrupt a substantive conversation and, I, and, and I'm not trying to do anything. I'm being myself. Eventually, Tom will say, go fuck yourself. Maybe it's today. Well, I'm sorry. Maybe you should listen to everybody else in the room. I mean, there's some people in this room I think are very smart. I'd say the majority are not, like, hyper brights. I, like, I'm going to listen to Tom. I'm going to listen to Ray. I'm going to listen to JJ a little bit. There's some other people. BB. Um, Claire, Claire, I like. I'm not listening, I'm not listening to Yuri. The shit I've heard about Yuri. I'm not, I'm not listening to Yuri. Buddy, hold on. Hold on, buddy. Did you name JJ? Yeah, he named JJ, dude. What's wrong with JJ? Going by people with sexy voices, we all know. Yeah, but that, the, the, why is JJ there then? Am I there? Nice voice. <laughs> My nice voice is terrible. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, JJ clearly has worked his magic on some people in this chat. He's oh, been funny. Oh he's had he's had funny ass moments. Time, it's time to take out the trash. Hand up to see yourself out. <laughs> why, don't you, why, don't, why, why am I excluded? Why don't you want to listen to me? Well, I, I, I mean, I've been, I've been, I've been here for conversations with people that know that know you, and and um, I, and, uh, I actually, well, I actually worry about you, dude. Like, I, 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 I worry about you without knowing you because I do care about people quickly, and and from the position that it seemed like you might be in. Um, I should be looking out for you. Like you shouldn't be advising me. They said you're like a very young person. You're not even a major. And whenever I hear somebody in this room or any room basically say like, I don't care if I'm alive or dead. Like I will, I will love them and and, res- and respect them as a human being. But I will try to help them. I will not take their advice. I'm not going to take their advice. I won't take their advice because of a truth. More philosophical topics than you probably have. Like it's just, just get out of here, man. But am I not speaking the truth? You, do, am I not speaking truth? Like, have you not been in danger? And like, do do we not look out for you? Do we not look out for you? Is this not a is this not a family of your? Okay, okay, dude. No, I haven't been like a bad topic. Yeah, I don't know why you're like getting personal with Yuri. I don't get it. I don't know how long you said you've been in this fucking. I didn't say any details. No, that's not talking really weird. That's just really weird. Like, just like leave Yuri's, you know, his history out of this. I agree with you. Just, just move on. That's really weird. Well, he's giving me advice. Like, what do you want me to say? Just, yeah, I just mean, just ignore it. Just ignore it. All right, all right, all right. Wait, 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 wait hold on. Wait, hold on. Wait, wait, all he wait. said, all he oh, said, that it. as a philosophical research, fuck you. yeah, Socrates. <laughs> <laughs> all he said that, as far as like philosophical topics, he's probably had more exposure than you have. And honestly, I think that's pretty true. He's probably had way more exposure than I have. I would consider Yuri like a good person to like have some debates with, you know, just to get familiar with the topics and get the blood flowing, you know? Yeah, so you're I, a good, I, I, smart kid. Right, okay, I, I just missed you know. So I start. I, I I'm 46 years old. I studied philosophy, politics, and law. I have been having discussions and writing about philosophy and and politics and, and a mil- like for many many years. He, if you're, you're like, I have no problem with you, but if you're like if you're 18 years old, right? You haven't even been an adult for a day. I'm 46 years old, so I've been an adult for decades, and all of that time I've worked essentially, I mean, I call myself an inventor, but there's a lot of philosophy. I don't study philosophy. I philosophize. I don't know, nobody in the world at 18 had the philosophical experience that I have. It's not possible. No problem with you, bro. I mean, this just seems like really weird age. This is embarrassing. It's too, it's too unusual to be true. 
Oh, it's too unusual to be true. There's two Hannahs. Abort. Can I say something? <laughs> We're breaking no, it up. This is a conversation. <laughs> squishy. Squishy, please go. Sorry. Go ahead, Squishy. I want to hear Chad. Squishy. Oh, I'm just going to make a dumb comment that it sounded like we were listening to his cover letter. Yeah. And I'm on the spot. <laughs> yeah. And then it doesn't seem that funny I anymore. wonder... <laughs> oh, con, so, uh, are you more of like an analytic philosophy guy or like a continental philosophy yeah, guy? Yeah, get him, Ziri. Get him. Well, I'm not trying to get him. I'm just asking out of curiosity. Um, I, I, wouldn't, I, I, I wouldn't... Do you, I wouldn't, do you think I wouldn't, the difference? I wouldn't use either one of those cool. words. Like, And when I describe myself, what I say first, of course, is I'm an inventor. I'm an intellectual explorer. Like, I'm, I'm worried about... I, I, I pay a lot of attention to democracy and specific manifestations of democracy. I'm not interested in a lot of obscure philosophy anymore. I'm not really interested... Well, not obscure philosophy. Analytic, the, the difference between analytic and continental philosophy, um, the reason why that's important, because there are two branches of philosophy that try to attempt to delve into different things, right? So if you're more into like mathematics, logic, things like that, you would be on the side of analytic philosophy. But if you read the works of like Schopenhauer, Hegel, Goethe, uh, people like that, you would be like or Nietzsche, right? Or I hope I'm pronouncing that right. But yeah, that would be more like on the poetry and more abstract thought, right? Yeah, okay. On, uh, things like that. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm what you call a hip hop popularifier. I'm a popular philosopher. I'm not saying I'm popular. Like I have a ton of views. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not like I'm about the, the philosophy of popular actually philosopher. Popular philosopher. I didn't. I didn't just make up words. words. That's all he does. No, it's not. That's yeah, ridiculous. Claire, that, some people say. Some people would say that making up words to add to our lexicon is a good thing. Well, Claire doesn't uh, say that. He, so fine. Claire's very smart, so but Claire sorry. maybe doesn't always. <laughs> it's a, it's okay. You're clue. You, yeah, I can't talk right now. See, Claire, I need what, someone to make up words for me so I can speak properly. Claire, what, what would make you say that all I do in my life is make up words? Doesn't doesn't that seem like the internet talking no, through you? No, all like, you do in the server is make like, up words. Like you say, I'm, I'm actually not an optimist prime, right? I'm not a super optimist fucking prime. Go. I'm No, but I also am one. So I don't just make up the words. I live that life right. But... <laughs> Claire, I don't, I'm not going to talk about like I'm, I can't talk about anyone, right? That, People that say things. Oh, that was a meaningful Please. argument you just made. Nah, this we is performance it... art. Uh, this is 100% performance it's art. Awful performance art. Yeah. That's the thing. What is perform? What is the he, art? He, do you this... think when he wakes up, he hums robots in this guy's trance? <laughs> Alright, no one else can laugh at that. Fine. Fuck His ringtones. I laugh. Fuck you. I mean, besides you, you're, you're obligated to laugh. I think we couldn't answer my question regarding analytic. He had to make up a... No, I, 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 it was already made up. Populosophy was already made up. Dude, listen, I studied philosophy in school. I got extremely sick of it. I got extremely sick of the fucking yeah. in-depth ter terminology and the academic fucking debate that never resulted in any actual real-world innovation. Hey, you're asking okay, where populosity lands wait, 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 on the wait. analytic... But you're asking where ask. populosity like, lands on the continental analytic distinction. Yeah, where does hip hop uh, philosophy lie on the continental analytic distinction? It doesn't. That's a lot. That's a line between two points. It's not on that shit at all. You're right. Just, so you made a claim. When, you made a, you made a claim. You made a claim that you said that uh, philosophy and academia, uh, the in-depth terminology, doesn't result right into anything like pragmatic or anything in the real world. But I'm just curious. Where do you think Einstein's um, uh, theory of relativity came from? Uh, philosophization, I mean, fucking, like, deep fucking thought. Yeah, it was just all conjecture, philosophical conjecture, right? That's all relativity was based on, right? And some, uh, not, I'm, well, I'm being facetious when I say that, right? There, of course, there were some empirical elements, right? Not, but not a lot, facetious, you're being general. General, yeah. But I'm just saying that a lot of how we came to the understanding of the theory of relativity is because of, like, philosophical conjecture, right? On how we, in, in metaphysics, and how we uh, determine and uh, certain models of metaphysics, things like that, right? And then we used that and came up with a theory of relativity based on that. We didn't do that shit. We didn't do that. Yeah, I, I know Einstein, and you are not Einstein. I don't know how smart you are, but you're not Einstein. We didn't do that at all. No, you already didn't say you're just being that. facetious. I think he said, I'm saying, I think yeah, he said, better, I think he used, used the word, word we. When I say we, and when I say we, I'm obviously referring to humankind. Right? Yeah, but that's, that's kind of a fallacy, like some kind of fallacy, right? I mean, because 99.99% of, of, of homo, sa homo sapiens do not innovate anything ever. They just fucking go to work. Wait, what am I, wait, I have to be appealing to something. So what am I appealing to that makes that reasoning for me? 
I, I actually, honestly, I'll say this. I'll take the penalty. I really am. I went to fucking school. I'm 46 years old. I walked away from everything you're talking about. If I want this, I will literally go back to, to textbooks and, and books of philosophy and the internet and read it myself. I don't need it through an 18-year-old mouthpiece. I don't need to be questioned by a fucking 18-year-old who I won't talk about, but I'm have heard, you. whatever, 17-year-old. I don't that understand I've... your obsession with age. Like, why do you keep mes- mentioning your age and his yeah. age as if that has I'm anything just, I, to I, do with intelligence? I, no, 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 no. I'm, 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 pres- I'm presuming that we have this, the same base natural intelligence, right? I did not do a lot of why great would work. Why you assume that? To be fair to you him. You shouldn't. To be fair to him. <laughs> Are you, How you're telling me that fair to him. To be fair to him, I'm. I'm like you're just like, being ageist on top okay. of that. So no, no. Not, none of that is fair. Yuri no, is no, emotionally no. stunted. Listen, listen, Yuri is emotionally and socially stunted, but he is in some ways a prodigy. <laughs> there's no reason for you to suspect that you're as smart as Yuri. Is. There's no yeah, reason for you to suspect. There's no reason in, of any of the words that I've written or said here that you that why right. you should not sp- suspect that I'm a more developed prodigy. The, in real in real an, life, an eighty IQ person on weed can come in, up with in, the puns. In in, in real life, it's not uh, knowledge. This is not real life. This is the internet, Claire. <laughs> like Again, it, an eighty I mean, IQ person in their twenties. High on weed can come up with the exact same kind of content you come up with. Okay, it's first of all, not I only took one. I have a super high, uh, I, high Q, right? I told you that. And IQ okay. test. Wait. And what IQ test did you take? What were your results? Hold on. It's just, I can do things very quickly if you don't interrupt. I said I have a very high Q. Yes. I took one actual answer. IQ test, and the, uh, on, on the, like the third worst day of my life, I took an Who IQ gave test. gave it to you? And I don't remember. Somebody threw my fucking school, and I got a 139 on that. That's the only IQ test I ever took. I'm a hey, subgenius, hey, technically. Someone from your school? Like, they don't administer IQ tests in school. Plus it was something private. associated with my... I went to amazing schools. I don't know exactly where I fucking oh, got the IQ test. What, what school did you go to? What school did you go to? I mean, the, okay, the first school that I went to was called Ledgeview Elementary School. You could probably find a way to check it Elementary. in the... Elementary? Um, no, you I'm said, what school do you go to? I'm just saying, right that's, where, that's where it I'm starts. I'm actually very... I'm very concerned and probably offended by your IQ school because I actually didn't the men's the test when I was in the military and got 139 and now I feel really fucking stupid. <laughs> it's okay, It's okay, Molly. They make mistakes on the test all the time. Dude, that was... What, what, what do you want me to say? I tell you the truth of, of a what? test that exists in the what? real world that what doesn't measure my doesn't. actual skills at all. Alex I don't gone. fucking what know. Was it? it was 25 plus years ago, dude. I don't know what test it was. It was an accredited fucking IQ test. Like... I come from a very conscientious school system, like with a lot of fucking great and successful students. They they, they, they provide access. Here's the thing about that. I googled the name of the elementary school you just mentioned. There's four of them that I found, and they're all public schools. Public schools do not Uh, administer IQ. I didn't. I don't think. No, 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 no. I took it. No, I took. You said what? Where did I go to school? Is a separate question. I said the first school that I went to. No, you said you got tested in school. I said what school? Oh no! I don't. I said I was tested in a, uh, through my school. They they gave us the option to take some kind of a fucking legitimate IQ test. So if you think I come from an illegitimate school district, they'd be that's, like, here, take a fake IQ a test. Thing. No yes, public. That's, that's not a thing. No public school, school IQ uh, offer, yes, offers IQ tests. I didn't Wait, say the school of the, this is ridiculous. Twenty years ago. This is nitwit picking. This is nitwit picking. Nitwit yeah, picking. They, they, guys, guys. Okay. Guys, what pro, what program? What Joking. program did they administer that test through? Because it wouldn't be part of the regular curriculum. What was the program called? You realize I'm, I'm 46, right? I, I don't know. No, I was I was also put in a fucking gifted program, like a lot of kids. So do the disabled uh, programs. Anytime you have an IEP, a lot of times they'll give you either the Weschler or the... Right, and that's why I asked them what program it would be, because it wouldn't be standard curriculum. It would be either a gifted I didn't say curriculum. Spe- special ed- I was, so most gifted no. programs don't give you an IQ test. They give right. you a cognitive skill test. I, I, I was in a well, gifted program and they didn't give me an IQ test. The IQ test I took, I think I was in middle school. I think I was in middle school, I think, for the IQ test. I know I was old enough that I was, at that point, I was actually a little bit, like, depressed. I'd had some shit go down that was negative with a girl that I really liked. So I wasn't in elementary school for the fucking IQ test. Can I add something? Can I add something? Uh, I took an IQ test in, in elementary school. I, I think it was six I'm not sure what it was. It was a test of, about whether or not to go in 
uh, the fast track or the other track. That was oh, the practice. AP? Yeah, that was a practice at that no, time. They don't do AP in, in, at that age, but yeah. they have a yeah, good that's what track. It was well, before going to like um, junior high, right? So, yeah, that's uh, very common. They'll do that. Yeah. So yeah. I took a I took an IQ test, uh, uh, some kind of a test. I did either right. way. Like I said, it, it, it'll right. never be a standard curriculum, though. That's all. That That's why be. I was asking what program. Yeah, but an African swallow may be. And my IQ at that time was 110, is what they said. So just, oh, that's above average. Yeah, but it's just slightly. It's not that much. Yeah. I mean, that's what I expect. probably the Weschler. That's what I expect. I've never tested uh, also, my Also, we shouldn't, we shouldn't dox him and, and, and figure out his Yeah. He doxes himself. Dude, you can dox me. I, I, can, yeah, I, can, tell you, I can tell you every school. I tell you every school I went to, it's no big deal. Don't do that. No, don't do I didn't that. say I'm going to. I said I would because I don't care because everyone knows is going to know this. Alex, can I ask you another question? Alex, can I ask you another question? What was your strongest composite and what was your weakest composite? Oh, I, I have absolutely no fucking idea what the constituency oh, they, of. I know they, that they gave me a score. They said they said you have a 139. I took a test in elementary school that put about 15 of us in a fucking very advanced program, mainly focused on on pure cre like it was creativity focused. They tested the whole school, and I've always been an amazing associator. I don't okay, just make uh, up words. Oh, I know you're lying because they never would never test an entire school with IQ. There was a whole the whole fucking cafeteria was full of fucking kids taking this yeah, test. IQ test costs like five hundred. This was not an IQ test. This was psychologists. This was a test to see who got to go in the fucking in the program. You th you know there's gifted programs, right? You really think so I'm was stupid. it an IQ test or wasn't it? The IQ test was in middle school or right IQ after middle school. For gifted students. Yeah, well, that was a test. It was just a test to see who yeah, they were going to put in IQ test for gifted students, but they would never give it to the whole school. Two different be, tests. To choose who goes in the gifted program. They would how would they, how would they figure out? Standardized testing. There were a lot of kids that were there. It's not like a lot of kids took that test. Yeah, I don't know. Like, wait. Wait, why does it cost five hundred dollars a test? Yeah, I, I know that doesn't sound right. Because it's just expensive. I've taken it before, and it's it was five hundred bucks. Yeah, My because, psychologist because it it for me. Because it has to be it has to be psychologist administered for it to be considered a valid. Oh, so, so you're it's paying not for just a, like. You're paying for the professionals, right? You're paying yeah, for the my, So it looks like a, it can go up to two hundred dollars, up to. Um, for so, myself, well, that's now. Uh, wait, 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 wait. I, I have another question wait, about it. I, wait, can I? Just, I just, 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 just want to get my question. Ahead, You're right after me, Molly. I promise. Uh, yeah. What mm -hmm. does the psychologist have to do with the tests to get the score? I thought it was like almost entirely standardized in how you interpret this. It's not a standardized test at all. Oh, okay. What it, what happens? So and I honestly, an IQ test doesn't even have most like basic questions like example, the first part of the iq test is actually has to do with um they give you a block that has um, a symbol on it and you have to recreate it with a set of blocks they give you and they see how fast it takes you and um and stuff like that oh like, like the that's like one of the first parts of the test yeah. like For most example, of it has nothing to do with actual the with the weschler with the weschler for um for grade school Age, for example, if you're testing to see whether or not they can go into the gifted program, you they make you have a psychologist in there because they don't want anybody putting too much pressure on the kid. So, like, they'll do um, a tanogram series that gets successively harder, and the instruction is just supposed to be just work on it until you don't want to anymore, and you put one puzzle, then the next puzzle, then the next puzzle, then the next puzzle. And so they think putting a psychologist in there is going to keep everything neutral so the kid doesn't feel pressured. Right. Either to yeah. quit early or um, to push too hard, etc. So the whole the psychologist so doesn't evaluate it then? No. Okay. Then who evaluates it? Helena, I don't think that's true. The evaluation I mean, is the simply The psychologist has a lot to do with it. The psychologist no, is the one the that administers it, writes up a report about it, they do administer it, but they also write up they, the report. They do on write it. up a report at the end, okay. that's true. Yeah, that I was going to say, when uh, I was in the military, I had a bit of a self esteem issue being called uh, illiterate and stupid by my mum, and it was something I started sort of believing. So when I was a psychologist, she was like, well, why don't we go ahead and um, whoever considered doing the Mensa? And it actually was uh, in Manchester. So yeah, I actually had the 
recommend that IQ test, and it was just sort of you know, to help me get over some past thinking that I was quite dumb and whatnot. Had it Did you have my mother, Molly? You and my mother have to. I have a mother like that, too. So, I just, want to, I just want to be clear and transparent with you, Alex Khan. I don't believe that you took an IQ test or that you got the score that you claimed. I'm that's, not trying to mean to you, but I No, that's completely I don't fine. Think you're being honest. You, uh, and I can't say, I can't quote you yourself, like, but you, you have said things that make me, like, that doesn't, I, I care about you, but that doesn't mean anything. I absolutely did. I absolutely, they said that I had a 139, and an IQ test doesn't measure anything creative at all. So that's, like, just what happened, it, and uh, you're calling me, you're calling me a liar or a stupendously delusional person, which is pretty rude. Yeah, you could be either or both. Fucking shoe fits. Elementary school was a long time ago, though. If you're 46. Yeah, that was a long. That was a long time ago, and I have. I probably would score a little bit lower on a regular fucking like IQ test. I'd probably get like. A, I mean, if if that was my real score, I'd probably only get a one thirty five now. Like I would go down a few points, but when it comes to put me into a problem solving <laughs> situation, and you would see what like what my brain actually does. I had a tryout for a fucking NFL football team. I was way, way too weak to you play for them. You committed an error in reasoning, sir. I had a tryout for an NFL football team. I said I was way. Now, I, I was. Now, I didn't, you, now you're just underscoring the fact that you're that you're delusional. Compulsive. No, I didn't make the team. I didn't. I didn't come close to making. I met. Okay. So what? What college team did you play for? I didn't play at all in college. I played oh. one year in high school. How, I, how how did you end up making it to an NFL tryouts without playing I was, college football? My father's uh, business, my brother, who was the president of my father's business, had a box at a Buffalo Sabres playoff game on the way to almost winning the, the cup. And, and in the box next to us was the general manager of the Bills, John Butler, who's now dead. I talked to him for a couple of minutes, and he set up a tryout. He wasn't at the tryout, and, I, and I'd hurt my shoulder, so I was not had no chance of making that team. All I really wanted so to do— just talk to someone, and then they decide to give you a tryout for professional football. Just right the, 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 gen you, the general you throw a football. You throw a he just, football, he, yeah. Receiver. It was a receiver. I can't throw for shit. I was a wide Not receiver. Not even catch a football. No, no. A receiver like the, like the radio receiver in your head? Right, Never like that. <laughs> First of all, you no know, a receiver does not need to be able to fucking throw. And I, I told you I didn't make yeah. the team. The hey, hang on, hang on, guys. I can throw. Do you want videos of me throwing? Do you want videos of me catching? What do you want? No. Sometimes, it, like sometimes it's set up special events for uh, mentally disabled uh, people. Wrench, is that I what you're going to say? Videos. <laughs> well, no. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna, gonna say that sometimes from... for football trials like that, they bring in scrubs so that some of the worst players on their team can fucking. No, them of course that's right. Themselves. I didn't. I didn't meet the team at all. I had one scout. He was like five eight. The dude was a dick, kind of like some of the people in this room. Only thing I did that was good in that tryout is right before right before I left, right before I walked out of the tryout, I said, throw this football. We're on the field, in the field house, and I said, throw this ball. Like, don't completely launch it, make it impossible, but throw it farther than you think I can possibly catch it. And I caught it, and that was the end of the fucking tryout. But my weightlifting was nothing because my shoulder had been hurt, so I didn't have any stats, and I had no chance to make the team. Did I catch a ball that was launched like a fucking wolf that's fast as fuck? Yeah, I did. Most Fact. pointless fucking tryout in the world. One catch is a tryout? No, I'm saying the last, the last catch. I asked, last catch. I, I asked him. Do you think we are, man? One what team was this for? The Buffalo well, Bills. Yeah. Yeah. So his IQ test is never. Wait, what, what team was it now? for, Alex? The Buffalo the Bills. Bills. Pay attention. This is so much bullshit. There's zero bullshit. There's zero bullshit. On my children's lives, I have not. St I stated one lie. On their fucking lives, there's no lies. There are no lies. No lies. Everything I said is true. I said one lie. There are no lies. <laughs> I'm not a white. I'm not even a white lie. I'm not even a white liar. Okay. I don't even fucking tell white lies. White lies matter. Oh god. We all okay. know this guy has kids. Did he have these kids before or after you chewed your own first so I, I have a ten year old and I have an about to be eight year old. I, I showed some of you the video of me talking to my daughter. Like I have a ten and a fucking seven year old. They're fucking beautiful smart kids. Like I like I didn't do anything. Nine yeah. I suspect you didn't even inspire them, but that's neither here nor there. Oh, boy. What is the pe you literally think I'm lying about this? Like everyone who thinks I'm a liar, just say yes in chat, so you can look back on think, this recording I think and you, you can say you literally think I'm lying. I think you having a kid is uncountable. Yeah, I don't think sticking your dick in somebody. I didn't wait. Like, we're not. It's not exactly directly connected. I mean, my kids are smart, but I wasn't. What? 
So, so I'm like, responding to somebody else. I'm not responding. Hannah, you should like you love Hannah. I'll, uh, I'm saying Hannah's great. Yeah, don't worry. I am getting massive whiplash right now. She, she has a thing for crazy people taking care of them, having sympathy for them. Well, you know? I swear to fuck, stop it. That's not even funny. Well, it's <laughs> fucking true though. It's I'm not even okay. Well, it's, it's real. Not. Uh, what fucking... year did you try out, Alex? Uh, let's see. Uh, I'd have to check the the uh, Buffalo sa like the Saber schedule the where the game was. I don't know. I don't know. I was like twenty two, probably. You tried uh, out 20... for, for, for a top line NFL team, but you don't remember what year. I absolutely tried out for. A, they, I don't know if they were top line at that point. I think it was after their peak. I'm not entirely sure how old it. Like, but yeah, I tried. I tried out for a team. Why would I lie? Why would I lie? What the fuck would I gain by going on the record and telling a lie? Why do you lie? No one knows because you're mentally ill. But how you do you? Lie? It's you apparent that you do. That's why you lie. That's the, the most, question we asked. Why the most do you lie? The most you're absurd lying. thing. The most absurd the thing. The answer is simple. He lies to pick up himself. But you know, sure. this, this, this is what happens. I swore on my children's lives. You know how ill I'd have to be. This, 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 is, this is how a compulsive liar works. You ask for details and they become fuzzy or contingent. Why well, would I have a specific... And fucking you can't get a straight answer out of it. That's how fucking uh, compulsive Scott, liars almost... work. I'm not... Uh, Scott, I must ask, sir, why the fuck are you lying? Well, why the fuck are you lying, sir? I said, listen, I'm just saying this, right? You should, if, if in fact you think, if in fact you should, you think that I'm this crazy, right? Because if I'm lying, it's actually a delusion. I was actually in the field house of the Buffalo Bills. I actually met John Butler at a fucking Sabres game. I actually got a tryout and the tryout didn't work out. And the fucking scout really seemed to not like me and thought I was arrogant and, and not qualified. But it fucking happened. It's not even a big deal. I'm, I'm, I'm able to talk to people in person. I'm a... I'm a tall person. I'm relatively attractive. I'm well spoken. I was in a fucking box. I was in a box from a rich company. The guy gave me a tryout. What is so hard to believe? He was the general manager, and he always was out for weird talent. So he gave me a shot. Hundreds of thousands. Wait, of people John Butler was the general manager. Every single day, and you got one. That's what's difficult. To Alex, yeah, that's that's the issue here. Is that you're at you're downplaying. Like, do you know how many people want to just get like on the list, and you just got it because you were in proximity to someone, and he without having your any physical stature, he thought your physical stature might like. No scout ever. No, does my that. confidence. He's not the scout. He was the GM of the whole fucking it team. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Don't, <laughs> don't do that. GMs don't mess around with the recommendations of scouts. GMs don't say, "Oh, I bumped into this guy, and it'd be really cool if you gave him a shot." Especially someone who has no the experience. Scout, Wait, did, did you say John Butler, Butler was the GM? The would quit on him if he did that. Exactly. He was a he was he was a very he was a very chubby guy. You can get a picture of him on the internet. Yeah, he did. Do, do you he understand? Like the John Butler isn't even chubby. John Butler's skinny. Uh, let's, let's, not, let's 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 go get the real John Butler. He's not a gym, He's not a general manager. The real he's a secondary coach. He's and dead. He's skinny as fuck. He's, he's dead. Bad. He's dead. I mean, it's irrelevant anyway. Like, it, so who it, it are you talking about? Happen. You there think there's John just one Butler, John who was Butler? A manager who died in 2003. That's uh, who he fucking is. So is talking about Buffalo Bills. You are assuming that, that because well, he wasn't fat either. Like, do you understand, like, what a highlight of, like, anyone's life that would be? How would you forget the time you're sitting in a VIP box office and the GM of a multi-million dollar franchise is like, hey, let's try out. You would remember that forever. Uh, no, actually, that was not the highlight of my life in any way, shape, or form. I've had a pretty yeah. fucking nice life. Maybe for your life that would be a highlight. It was a tryout for well, a pro professional sports business. I'm fucking six two. I'm two hundred pounds. Wait, I, I'm so I, I'm sorry, but I Hannah, you think I'm lying? Like, but I don't. Excuse me, I don't even like American football. But fuck me if I wouldn't remember down to the fucking minute if something like this ever this, appeared in my life. Exactly. This reminds me of this guy who told me that he had he had a custom made Mercedes and he went all the way to Germany for it, but he couldn't recall what city or when he did it. But he just knows he had that you know half a million dollar car. Like this is this is, this is right up that line. You would I mean, remember these details. Is there is there anyone in here who's not sure that I'm lying that could speak up? Like, just maybe. You ever seen twelve? I'm not sure that you're like, lying. Maybe. I'm sure that you're lying. And you're sh and Hannah, you're sure you're sure I'm lying, Hannah? I'll be honest. I don't. Do you know how do you, do you know how do you know how rude that is though? And not giving a fuck is even ruder. Like when people make me talk I'm about not this shit. Giving a fuck is rude. When you're asking me all these <laughs> questions, you ask all these questions without even giving a fuck. You're just trolling uh, me. Then. Am I asking? 
You we start. You st- st- we all need to be. Yeah. 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 Talk about yeah. Hannah's biography. It's like, what the hell? How can you complain about us not giving a shit about I what wanna, you're saying? You're making. When wanna people. Wait, 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 wait. I want to point out something really quick. It was Hannah that like, like got us on the nose that there's some suspicious about our friend here, and now all of this is coming to the front. We could thank Hannah for like, like opening the treasure box of possible lies. What did I? I only told you two things, right? What did I tell you? I said my IQ was 139. You call me a liar. I said I tried out for a football team and failed, uh, and you said I'm lying. That's all that happened, and like everyone is certain that I have to be lying. It's so weird. Because the you, premise because, of you, because your because story the is. I just don't remember the year. I don't even care. It just happened. It doesn't like, matter. It doesn't matter. I want to also point out something really interesting there. You didn't just try out for a football team. You tried out for a major league fucking fantastic. <laughs> okay. And this is a guy who got some weird talents, right? And he took and the team to the... He called some majestic pass. He just something. grabs dudes out of the audience at football games and throws no, them out no, there like, for a like, tryout. It's, it's even worse than that. Like, he's you're sitting in a VIP box. A guy who doesn't concern himself with recruiting for the for the, the NFL team just goes, hey, let's give this guy a trial because he's 6'2 and might be over 200 pounds. Like, no, it was probably it was hundreds and thousands of dollars that goes box. in. To like to training to training the team like even the guys that are on reserve and they just did it on a whim. Just, yeah, I'm they probably good. don't even have the insurance to cover some sort yeah, of shit maybe, like that, right? Maybe he just spoke to me face to face and 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 heard my confidence and said, "Fuck it," you know. You, he maybe he said, "You never know. That's this guy's big. Maybe. This guy's or, or, he's the general or, manager. He can do whatever or, he wants." Or, or no, maybe yeah, he is mind. the GM, but GMs have other people that take care of the recruitment process. They don't just sit there and go, uh, this guy was real fun to have a beer with. Let's uh, let's try him out for this multi-million dollar team. It didn't cost him anything. It cost him 30 minutes. Beer. It cost him 30 minutes what of a you, shitty scout. He made something. the determination in less than a half hour. Get the fuck out of here. No, he made the determination in like three minutes. I'm saying I only spent about thirty oh, minutes. Oh, well, fuck me, running. I only listen. Sometimes so you, people you in those you both caught. You, you said you both caught a ball and lifted weights and did the weight test. There's no way you can do both. Three minutes was at the That's Sabres bullshit. game. Three minutes was at the hockey playoff game where I was right next to him talking to him. That was a three-minute conversation, maybe five. The tryout only yeah, lasted about 30 was, minutes, and he didn't even bad. he didn't even show up. He didn't show up for the tryout. He sent an underling to give me a look. That's what happened, but it was in the field house, and it was a tryout. What do you want me to do? This is crazy. You're all confident of an absolute fallacy. Absolute fallacy, and you're all 100% confident. It, this is some group. This is some group think bullshit. Like straight up group think bullshit. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Your life is a fallacy. So he went by and he saw probably this sad looking mutt bit, and someone said, "Hey, you think you can like, go on and let him throw the ball and just you know, just for shits and giggles?" And you found as a tryout. Brilliant. I don't, I don't How do you know what a general manager would do? Interest in their day to do such a. Right, well, though. you know what? I, because I, I I'm the general you, manager I of the uh, Patriots. Any, yeah. That's why. I, I can get you any, it's any not that serious. How boring are your lives? Anything, is it no, 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 no. no. Hold on. Hold on. So a cursory Google search, which I already knew this, but I just wanted to verify, shows the requirements before you're even on the field. You have to do a physical fitness assessment. So what was your vertical, Alex? Because that's what the NFL uses as a precursor to determine your potential because it's very hard, if not impossible, to increase your vertical which is why the NFL uses it, because it's a very good indicator of your natural ability to use energy. What was your ver- I, I told you, I, I, they put me on the oh, weight, but they put, I don't know, I don't, so you didn't have to do a vertical, you didn't have to do the 225 bench press test. No, I was on the bench, and I told you, I, listen, I just had a shoulder operation, I am only here because the general <laughs> manager brought me here. <laughs> what? No, I was already there. I was already there. I said, "Let's." I said, "Really, I came here to do one thing, which was to." Sh- Wait, to sh- why would they try out someone who had a shoulder injury? Shoulder injury. Yeah. I was capable it's of. It's like an insurance company placing house insurance on one that's on fire. I why didn't tell. Is- listen, I didn't. I don't think I even mentioned that to the general manager. I wanted. I hoped he would be there and he could see me catch balls that yes, were thrown but very if you showed, long. Uh, if you show, listen, Alex. If you showed up with that injury and then told them that when you got there. They'd say, oh, we can't let you do this because we don't want to be liable for a possible injury. Right, I didn't I didn't do the, the bench press, right? I didn't do the bench press. I just caught some fucking balls. You didn't do anything. You, you didn't, didn't do, do any of this. Hurt? None of this happened. You're absolutely 100% incorrect. This, you know what this is? Honestly, this is a true story, absolutely. This is nitwit picking. It's fucking nitwit picking. It's groupthink nitwit picking. 
Scott, we're nitpicking on like very established, like decades. I because I don't remember my vertical that I don't give a fuck about at all. It didn't happen. I just don't remember. I smoke weed for twenty five years. You don't remember years. anything. You don't remember the the issue isn't so much that it's hard to believe that you try. It's the context. You were the GM did it. Like you you've got all these firsts that are just unheard of. You can't recall any part of the test. You were injured. Like none of this makes any sense to How you. you not, to you, you're no, a skeptical fuck in an internet room that likes to haze people and call them liars automatically it's not even a, it's not even a hard story it's anyone that was tall like confident uh and in a rich position could probably have a decent no. chance if they met a no, general manager rich is not it's not something they look for in a if you're player. if you're in the bo people in the boxes have different relationships claire i'm sure you have enough money now that you've spent time in the boxes somewhere and you've been around people who consider no one, themselves to no be of a higher cares. class than most of you no and they talk to each other if you're rich when it comes to res recruiting sports talent. It means you can get next to him at a fucking playoff game where everybody wants tickets, and he ends up talking to you with a couple beers in him and thinks this is a really cool guy. Fuck it. No one no. recruits, no one no. recruits no. professional athletes on the basis of he coolness. He didn't recruit me. I asked him very seriously, could I have a tryout, please, Mr. Butler? I'm very fast, and I'm kind of batshit. There's a You're chance very maybe. fast. <laughs> I'm not very fast. No, like, no, what, what? I'm not fast now. I'm not fast. They don't consider how fast you ejaculate when they're he's, he's when they're said, scouting you for special. I'm I'm very fast and I'm kind of batshit. Oh, what's Good. wrong with either one of those? Let's I'm not kind of batshit. No, you know you know what I like in this too. Yeah. Uh, you know uh, this reminds me of um, there was a person that came in and he was spouting no he military Afghanistan and. Going on and on and on and I and I said, Ah, where'd you do basic at? He says, Oh, I don't remember. He's using he's using okay. the same he's using the same counter like Tucker Max did, who ran that blog, who just pathologically lied about how his life was, and his defense was always like, you know, don't get mad that my life's so crazy and yours is boring. Like that's, 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 that's all you're saying, like. In virtue of the fact that your life is so interesting, we just can't comprehend. No, why would I make up that story? Why would I make up such a stupid story? It doesn't say anything about me. It's not a defense. People do that all the time. It's not like lies all the time. She's a registered sex offender on the board of Lipton. We're supposed to believe that too. Like it's it's. Yeah. Again, like I said, that you know, as soon as that I asked that bloke about, oh, which do basic, and he said, I don't remember. I do not remember the date, I, I, the I date of an IQ I'm test. Still talking. But you don't say I'm anything. Talking. I'm still talking. So, yeah. So, as soon as he said, I don't remember where he did basic, I'm just like, oh, well, I don't have to question this fuck any further because that's a fucking blatant lie. How could you forget where you did basic training? Just Basic you know, training? Who did like, basic training? What are you talking about? I never did. I'm not a fucking soldier. You oh haven't gosh. been fucking listening to what she's been saying. Because she doesn't say enough Just... to even fucking like. What is she saying? Like, okay, what... let me okay, let me repeat it to you. <laughs> you remind me of a person who came into one of the servers, bouncing about being in the military, talking about all the shit he did in Afghanistan. So, and if anyone knows me in the server, they know that I zone in right on that. So I was getting ready to ask him a few questions, and my first question to him was, "Where did you go to basic?" And he said. I don't remember. Oh, sure, dude. Basic training is a huge thing. You're there for fucking weeks and weeks and weeks, and you get the shit beat out of you. I was at an IQ test for two hours or something in some school building near my house. I don't remember any of those fucking buildings, nor do I want to. Not a good story. Like, okay. I just... I would have said I'm a 145 or a 150 if I was lying. Jesus I was, Christ. I was... I was paralyzed... Par paralyzing. Paralyzing the story to your uh, trying out for football. Not, not your fucking. Life, can I just, can I say one thing that I like to say to the camera? Nah, fuck, fuck you, internet! Really, fuck yeah, you, yeah, internet! Really fuck you, internet! You think I'm lying? You're fucking hilarious. Fuck you, internet! Do you think uh, we're just all like the internet is one mass what? hive mind that you're what? arguing against? I was just taking why a time. Why do you think that the internet would believe him to begin with? Right, as if like we're expected to believe that just on the basis that we're the internet. I didn't say you should believe me. You shouldn't automatically yeah, disbelieve me. Yeah, you did. Yeah, like you all, you all think I'm lying, and you're all wrong, and that's just a fact of the universe you right think now. I'm lying. Why do you, you think, think I'm lying? lying? It's not about what you have your own problems, and you're probably a liar. Wait, 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 wait. Whoever did that loud fucking bullshit, don't ever do that again. Right. Yeah. In virtue of the fact that you weren't here to give him the story to begin with, it's presupposing that you want us to believe it, right? Otherwise, you wouldn't be saying. It. Of course, I'm. I guess I'm telling you the truth. Sadist that likes to kind of like. But I didn't say anything crazy. 
Did I didn't fluff myself up. Telling us the truth. The fact that you I, I'm absolutely. I, I told you. Is, the fact that you don't think your story is crazy is. Let me say this: If if I if I've told a conscious lie in 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 this conversation, a right? A conscious lie, as opposed to you being unconscious and then telling a lie. If I've told a lie, in the, I'm saying I could be completely delusional, right? I could have. And you guys yeah. are saying, obviously, this is a delusion, is what you're saying. It's not a it's not a lie. Yeah. It's a mental oh, illness. No. No, it's, it's a, a fabrication. Lie. No, it's a lie. All, all lies are conscious. It's part of what it means to be a lie. Delusion is not a lie. I'm so, so, so stop. So don't call it a lie. Don't call me a liar. Then call me call me delusional. Well, how do we know you're delusional instead of lying? I just think that's the the far more likely option. But it is the internet. Like, why would why? I tell you the truth? It sounds better. No, like on, it's like calling on, like a cold or on. you know. Why is it a far more likely option? I mean, for the average person on the internet, yeah. I mean, people generally lie all the fucking time, right? People lie all the time. And if you're a liar, if you're a liar, when you meet somebody, you're going to think they're probably a liar. I meet people and I assume maybe they're telling the truth. Hold on. Hold on. But that's evidence that you're lying versus delusion. So why should we think you're being delusional versus lying? I wonder. I just wonder why the whole crowd becomes like extra reinforced in its own crowd belief that I'm literally a bullshit artist or a mentally ill person will, because that, because of some me, tiny allow me, story. Allow me, please. Allow me to answer that oh, for you. You get to do that. Um, but I'm gonna go after you. Yeah. Okay. Um. Because a lot of us have been on internet and in these groups and platforms for five, six, going on even longer. So we've pretty much fucking seen it and heard it all. So after a while, you do become quite proficient uh, to weed out bullshit. Jaded. You become yeah. over proficient. You become, you overreach and you okay. say everybody who thinks big is an idiot or a liar. Like you do think that anyone who's a genius or says they're a genius is an idiot and a liar. Every, <laughs> you right, cannot, right. you okay. cannot okay, have no, a genius no, no, no. in this room. That's because fine. they're because That's they're fine. fake. Hold on. Oh. We talked. That we said earlier, right, even by my own admission, people on the internet lie all the time. But that doesn't mean like uh, we shouldn't just assume that you're lying, right? But nonetheless, given our background information that people tend to lie a lot on the internet, why ought we believe you're being delusional oh, versus yeah. lying? I mean, you can watch one stupid catch with one hand is one thing. You can watch, like, see, do I look like I ever played receiver? Can I catch a ball that's been thrown pretty quickly and catch it with one hand? I don't have unlimited evidence. I do not remember the fucking year. I don't remember the – I only remember, like, 91 as one of the years but where the Bills, like, lost the you're Super Bowl. You're referring to things that we haven't seen or experienced. This isn't evidence we have fine, at our disposal. Fine. So it doesn't make sense that we would use this non-existent evidence to sway our opinion. So again, why ought we consider you lying versus delusional? Or delusional versus lying? Let me think about that. Why should you think? I mean, I'm, I'm obviously, well, okay. I'm very, very strong and very strong, unconditionally strong in defense of the truth, right? I said, if I'm actually lying, well, uh, inshallah, may my children die. Time. May my children yeah, die if I'm lying to you. Well, that, that's not going to help. That's not going to help. No, I'm just saying, fine, then you realize I'm extra crazy, right? Or I'm extra confident that I'm absolutely telling the truth and the internet is fucking delusional as fuck. Or you're lying. Or it doesn't life. matter. Like, why would I tell such a stupid story? Look, why would I? Why on. would I tell such a stupid story? I don't get it. I'm not People, stupid. I'm delusional. The, remember? The, the stupidity of the stupidity of the lie usually doesn't factor in to the idea that people in it lie about bullshit all the time. But everything that you've said so far only really pushes us toward the lying, not toward the delusional part. I mean, I'm just saying, I'm like, the, the, the delusional part would come from the certainty, right? Like, I'm absolutely all in that everything you've heard is truth. I'm not going to make up a date so for no you. confident liars? You don't think there are confident liars out there? I'm saying if you're that confident and, and you're wrong, you definitely have a serious mental illness. So it's not a pure lie. You're not, self, you're not fully self-aware. You're in deep fucking trouble. If you think something happened like that and it didn't happen, that's more than just but, a lie that's, that's just, going on. That's just assuming you that you don't or you think that it did happen but the point is when we're trying to evaluate whether someone's a lie we don't know that they think it's true or they think it's a lie the point is for us as the person talking to you there's not much evidence to support you being delusional over being a liar either way whatever i'm, a, I'm delusional or a liar right all right so then you agree that it's it's fine to think that you're a liar over delusional it's not. It's it's okay. It's your right. It's your prerogative to no, think no, that I'm no. a liar. No, no, no. Talking about the, the weighing of evidence, right? If we we have this bundle of evidence, right? A lot, most of it po points toward liar versus delusional. So then you would say, well, okay, well that's fair to think that I'm a liar versus delusional. 
I, I I don't know about I don't know about that. I got this is going on a little too long. I don't know. Obviously, I'm saying I'm no, I'm truth you know, truth. I say I'm saying I'm truthful. About that? Right. Yeah, I don't know. I it's just saying that. I don't just see. I don't even see what it resolves. Like like I'm obviously dealing with a bunch of people asking a bunch of things. Like I'm trying to stay focused on something that matters. The thing I want to resolve is you were saying that it's absolutely ridiculous to think that you're lying over being delusional. But if most evidence points toward lying, then you should be saying, oh well, then that's a fair assessment to make. Okay, fine. For you guys with the information that you think you have, presuming already that the other shit that I told was a lie, like when I said I don't remember the date of an IQ test, if you ask the average person in the world, do you remember the date of the IQ test that they took, they're not going to know. Like, even okay, geniuses... So you agree. All right, then we're good. Then we're good. Then we're good. But that evidence doesn't say, like, that I'm lying. It just says I don't remember a non, non-consequential day. The, the, the trial not, was a non-consequential day. That's the day we want you to remember. The day we want you to remember is the day you apparently so-called tried out for the right, trial. Right, that was not a consequential day either. It yes, happened it in an hour you know and it was you over. I didn't make the team. Let me, what do I, what let, do me I... Ask you something. let me ask you something. If, if, that, if, that, if that tryout had been successful and you'd made the team, would you have remembered then? That's what I was going to say. Of course, if I fucking made the team, it didn't go well. No, so it at didn't the go... time, yeah, yeah, okay. So at the time, it was important to you. No, it was. I mean, I I would have liked to have made it, but there was no need. Uh, I just thought, may, I thought maybe, I thought maybe that the the GM. Oh, it's like trying, it's like trying to punch yeah, water. No it's like I thought, trying to punch water. This guy, like I thought, the GM God, might like, come to the tryout and. Hold on, hold on. My kid's mom's calling. I got. I'll, I'll be back. Sorry. Yeah, go get lost for God's sake. One second. Affliction. Kids, mom calling. Bye. Be back right soon. Second. Yeah, good luck. What's up? What do you want to answer my texts? Because I'm I'm finishing some stuff up. Like anything you want, I got. You like it? Okay, anything. What are you finishing up? Just work. I don't. I'm, I cannot get into a discussion about what work is. You don't. Like I can't because. I have to get into a discussion about what work is. We okay. There. When do you want me there? And I'll try to like get. I'll, like, do you need me really early, or do you just? Yeah. Well, that's insane. Well, I'm not getting there before you. So wait, 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 wait. Wait, Chris. Um, I'm almost positive that, like, since I am working, that Chris and Papa and Alyssa would love to see you guys with just the kids without me for a little bit. And I'm not yeah. trying. I'm not trying to make that happen. But they would love to see. They'll be. It's much easier when I'm not there in the beginning. It's not on purpose. But they, like, Alyssa loves the kids. She'll fucking like, like. Chris loves the kids. He'll play with them. Like if I'm not there, then whatever they can. You guys can spend an hour or whatever and just fuck around and and everything's good. If I'm there before you, I'll I'll try to wrap it up and and hurry. But I I didn't. You've been there before before me and it, nothing. Okay, that was before all the good bullshit and everything else. If you just if you just go there and don't worry about me, I will add another. I swear to God, I'll add another hundred fucking dollars to what I owe you. I'll make it thirteen. Again, I'm not you. I don't need money. You do. But it's you're at, like I can't. Like, you're gonna have to sit and wait, and that would be insane. They're, those are your. That's your family. So yeah. So why don't we just go tomorrow morning? I thought. Uh, kids aren't gonna be there till tomorrow anyway. I mean, we could go there tomorrow morning. That's fine. I thought you left. Yeah, to get your fucking ass moving. And then you see my kids. Oh, okay. Well, either okay, okay, okay. Then what? Either way, maybe, maybe. If you guys want to go in the morning, maybe I, in that case, maybe I will go down tonight and and buy food and have everything ready. If you want to go tomorrow, that's fine. That's probably no, no, the kids don't want to go tomorrow. Well, go early. Just get up, like literally stop at something like. Go tomorrow early. No, wait, wait, guys, guys, hold on, guys. What I want, listen, relax, relax. If if that's what happens, okay, I am working. I'm getting I'm getting effed right now because I I, I have to take this call. And um, it, if we go tomorrow morning, you'll you can leave early. You can stop halfway down. There's like a Denny's, and you can stop. I'll definitely give Mama extra money. You can get some pancakes and eggs and bacon halfway there. Get down there. You'll still be there before Kirk, right? So you'll still be there before Kirk. You can get set up. You have a nice day. What's that? What time is Kirk getting there? I don't know. I'll have to I'll have to ask him i just assume it's not crazy early but the kids will have a number of hours with, with each other um hopefully they can just have a great time you know get up on sunday fuck around for a couple minutes get back home everything's good um and next year will be even better if you want to go down tonight though it's obviously it's whatever that's if you don't want to 
Don't. If you do, it doesn't matter. Like it, it, it'd be even if you could go down by yourself and stay, and you and the kids would fucking still love it. I mean, you could walk around with them. Like whatever you want is fine. As long as we don't have to like have a discussion today about what I'm doing, because I'm definitely not doing anything fucked up. So like it's all good. And I just I'm sorry that I needed a minute. I'm sorry I need an hour. But if you want to go, if they need you to go, it's really up to you. Let me know. I, if you're going tonight, I'll try to get, I'll wrap my shit up as fast as I can. If you're not going tonight, maybe I'll go down tonight. So when you guys come down, everything will be ready and it'll be super easy. You can just, whatever. Hey, they can. You're really going down tonight. Hey you, listen, I really want, listen, I love you so much. I really want you to, from now on, I want you to like, listen a little more to mommy and clean up a little better. Okay. And, and when I, and when I, when we ask you to read books, read those freaking books. We don't always get what we want. I don't know what mommy's going to do. It's up to her because she has to do the work. She's the one that has to drive you down. She has to pack everything and she has to deal with you. It's up to her and her determination of like, do you listen to her all the time, right? Are you being super good for mommy? And if she... Get out of here. Basically, I'm, I'm saying it's up to you. You guys want to go. Don't make me fucking walk over there like I'm in the fucking restaurant. Hey, the only... Pop, I think Papa's fully aware. I'm sure Papa thinks, yeah, maybe you enjoy an hour or two hours. Maybe you enjoy eating dinner with the kids and the family. But I think he probably thinks you're coming down for them, right? You're coming down because you love his grandkids, your kids, and you want them to be happy and to see their see their cousins. Like, So it, he doesn't think you're going down to take advantage of like a big house. He knows you're bringing the kids down to experience life and happiness. So if you go right now, nobody cares. I'm telling you, if you go down now... It'll be beautiful for a while. Like you'll get like Chris does. Chris loves you. Chris likes talking to you. Like he's not gonna be drinking. Really? The, yeah, he likes talking that to the. Not I mean, he doesn't see you much. I'm just saying he he likes talking to you way more than he likes talking to me. Oh, I'm a, I just well, he seems to like like he he could be interested. I don't know. Um, no, you're not. But Alyssa is a good a good mom. She's a good girl. Um, and Papa, like whatever, like whatever you want to do. I can't tell you. I can't take options away because I, 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 I need your options to be open. I'm not trying to control anything. It's up to you. I haven't seen them a lot for a month. I don't know how they're behaving. If they've been really good, I think you should take them tonight. If they've been, if they've been pretty bad to you, if they've yelled at you, if if they've been bad, if they've been doing Jeffy or something, maybe you just wait till tomorrow. But if they've been amazingly well behaved, take them tonight. I don't know how good have they been. Good. If they haven't been good, then maybe just go in the morning and explain it to them. Like, listen, next year, I mean, they're not bad, but if they haven't been really good, we probably need at some point to show them, listen, you want to go down Friday night. I'm not going at all. What? That's the best way to show them. No. I know, but you, the fact. Right the, but you, but school, you, aren't you I'm mostly. There. Okay, but you did, and there's some stuff from from Evan, and and I'll get you some money soon. I just, I mean, don't do not take it away. Just take them early in the morning and stop at Denny's, and I'll give you extra twenty dollars. Buy a bunch of pants. I'm saying go early. Just get up, get dressed, go take a coffee, stop and get food, and go down to the fucking lake. They'll have, they'll have all day. They'll have over twenty four hours that way. Hannah, but you, you honestly, no matter how beautiful and smart and loving you are, you do sometimes just not listen, right? I mean, honestly, you do sometimes just not listen at all. Sometimes you, like, yell at us. Sometimes you don't ask to clean up your room. There's a lot of th You're very good in a lot of ways, but, like, we need to provide you with rewards that are connected to something. Mama said you weren't being that good, so you can't just cry again and say, oh, please, please. You say that a lot. I don't want Mama stressed out. You guys are fine. You're happy as shit. You can cry for a minute, but Mama's an adult, and she has the stress of two kids every day, okay? Uh, we got to worry about Mama, too. You're very happy, very blessed kids, and I'm pretty sure she's going to take you down. Just be good, and don't cry if she says we'll go early in the morning and have a whole damn day. Maybe it even gets nice out on Sunday, and you can stay early afternoon. And I'm almost wanting to say, I love you so much, you know, but I'm almost wanting to say, F it. Like, you need to learn to embrace the good things that we're, that we're going to get you. And if you can't get extra, be, still be happy for what you're getting. Hannah, you guys are so, you're so happy. That's why you cry so easily, because you're so happy and life is so fun. What's up? What? 
talk to you later. So let's go. What do you think? I don't know. I mean, if you whatever you want, just do it. I mean, I'd pack up mostly. You probably already packed up. Lar right away. Are you largely ready you to? Take those pants off. Are you largely ready? I got your clothes. Don't you worry about your clothes. Do you understand me? Hey, what? Hey, he's got one ridiculous fault and pissing in his pants, and it's absurd, and yeah, it's got to stop. But. Okay, well, I'm not going to sit here and fucking chase him all the time. I mean, it's a behavior issue. See what you are wearing. It's a behavior issue. I mean, it's shitty. It's annoying, but, like, there's much worse things. He... The, the fucking arbiter of everything Southern, you fucking racist. <laughs> That's Fuck, I forgot South I forgot the South was a race. My bad. That is land. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, that's actually good. I'll ask Landon when he's around. Welcome back, Alex. Welcome back. Oh fuck. Oh man. Uh, you know, I don't know, uh, but we should probably establish this. Hannah, is your your DMs aren't open, right? Uh no. Uh sorry, buddy. I'm gonna have to wait for that. Hey, you definitely have, um, it's what we call uh, positive illusions going on there, but... Who? Other than the Alex. I don't, I mean, okay, positive illusions. I mean, I call them, mm -hmm. uh, ideas. <laughs> no, <laughs> like, I call yeah. them ideas for things that I think mm -hmm. may happen in the future. I don't know for mm -hmm. sure which ideas are good enough to be crowdsourced or not. It seems pretty reasonable mm -hmm. from my perspective. Mm. You know what? Fuck it. I'll bite. What are some of the ideas you've had? Oh, God. Uh, yeah. Oh, thirst God, oh my real. God. The thirst is real. <laughs> I can't. Uh, I'm curious. Yeah. He said he wants to crowdsource this. No, 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 no. no. I need to understand what idea he's thinking of crowdsourcing. And it really yeah. wants to investigate you for some reason. Are you, no, that, that part is scary. I'll, give, I'll, scary. Give you, I'll give you one if you pick some kind of category of international products. Category of international products. Some oh, kind wow. of some kind of product type. Uh, say from... capsaicin cream. Say, Hannah, say capsaicin. What? Cream. That's too specific. No, uh, wait, wait, so wait, if you don't want something specific, what are you talking about? I don't want caps like like uh, vehicles, uh, furniture, foodstuffs, okay, franchising, pick, pick, like digital pick entertainment, one. space travel. Exotic I mean, pick fish. One. Exotic fish. Okay, the, the only exotic fish we have. No. Okay, no. Only about. Uh, say 42 of the 420 cut down ideas are actually for hardcore products. So this is really only like 42 ideas I'm claiming are worth a lot of money, right? Um, the only, ex the most exotic fish we have is actually a, a mammal, and and her name Fuck, is. You actually picked the right topic. Fuck. Her her name is. Uh, he just called a fish a mammal. What I said I said it's not a fish. It's a mammal. Holy. Uh, the only oh. fish we had was a mammal. That's no, not a mammal. The most exotic fish we had is a mammal. Yeah, I, wait, yeah. wait, which is actually not a fish, it's a mammal. Do I have to add that many oh, fucking... Yes, yeah. you do. If Someone, I say, wait. If I, Alex, if I say the best sports car I have is a Ford F-150, it's not a fucking sports car. It's obviously an orca, it's not a fish. <laughs> Jesus Christ, like are you guys that stupid? Sports car, more like the best sports car you have is a bicycle. That's this yeah. is, this is, yeah. you're turning this into pure fucking ludicrous performance art. Obviously everybody okay, knows that a fucking orca know. is... So the, so the most exotic sea animal you have is a mammal. Go on. Her name is uh, Myth Orca, and that may actually, that's in the top six possible names for publication for children. But that's not a product. Okay, you know what? There is a product from that. And since I'm not, I'm not here to pander to people who call me a fucking liar, Myth Orca expands into a number of things. One of them is called Myth Aquarium, right? Like, I, I, I am aware of the existence of a thing called Shark Tank, where you get all your money from five douchebags, right? Myth or Aquarium is what happens when you pre-mine a shit ton of ideas and then you take it directly to the population. So when Myth or Aquarium, the mythical orca aquarium, goes on even television, everybody that is watching that in a dedicated way would also have an application on their phone and they probably have at least two cents in the fucking company. So when, our, when people come on to Myth or Aquarium and they present their inventions, the first 420 of which are already invented by me, the money must come from the wisdom of the crowd sorcerers. So Mithorka is a character. Um, she's also most likely going to be a submarine. Uh, it's a show called Mythor Aquarium, and then there's, <laughs> and then and then there's a, a thousand foot long jet zeppelin, also what named. The Fuckers, also, about. also named Mythorca, and and this and this giant jet. Awesome. This giant. Are you guys not following along? This is pretty. No, this giant jet zeppelin. Hold on, this giant jet zeppelin is also is modeled. 
The giant jet zeppelin is 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 modeled exactly after Mythorca. In my story, Mythorca is a mutated whale with Sky unbelievable and, with unbelievable what ingenious. The, are you telling us about a fever dream you have? I'm talking about a, a, a fictional. So I'm talking about a fictional orca that has a set of mutations that occur at conception. And she and she is she has a. Mark Thomas is here, guys. Mark Thomas is here. You're wait, come on, man. It's fictional Forca. Come on. Okay, so orca, go on. Guys, we don't want to hear Calm down. So listen, real quick. So this orca, orcas have huge brains, right? With with a small mu with a small <laughs> mutation in the brain of an orca, right? They could, in fact, probably become really fucking bright, right? Like an orca, in theory, could evolve to have amazing ingenious. Now that orca also could communicate with my daughter, who's doing an internship at the Monterey Bay Aquarium, right? She could learn how to speak English. <laughs> And Russian from submariners, right? She could literally listen to submarines to learn how to speak Russian and uh, English. My kids no. swear. My kids swear like motherfuckers already. We're gonna blame it on the communications with Mithorka. Mithorka. Wait, 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 wait. What? <laughs> Why are you guys uh, stopping him? What's yeah, what's up? What's up? Let me let me dig let me dig my grave, slaves. Guys, I want to hear about the relationship. Okay, when you're done, Molly, I want to hear about the relationship between your and your daughter. Thank you. Go ahead. fucking question. So, I, is your daughter actually working in Monterey Bay, or is this no, Molly? Don't story? ask that question. My daughter's ten. My daughter's ten. Okay, thank you. That's all I wanted. Quit being I, 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 there's lady time. I'm a pre-science fiction fiction writer. Okay, I'm writing science fiction that aligns with my own ideas. Oh, just ruined all of this. What is pre-science? Pre no, no. Before he, under before he understands what science, he's writing science. Pre-science or what prescience. Do you know what prescience is? Pre-science, right? It's like, it's, it's, a, it's, no. it's something related to prophecy. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, no, you don't. Those oh two God. words are not fucking derivative oh or interactive. God. I just said yes to keep it going. Pre-science fiction. Yeah, Presci prescience. Prescience. Prescience fiction. Prescience fiction. Prescience fiction. Okay. I got a lump on the end of my dick that's more prescient. He was close. Uh, little, little question. Uh, you guys can't you help but hear yourselves talk 24-7? Just let this guy talk. Yeah. Oh, really? Because if we let him talk... Guys! Guys! Yeah. Everyone be quiet. Everyone be quiet. Everyone, be quiet. Everyone please, please be quiet. So tell me more about like what prophecies are in like the science like theories. I well, the, the, the underlying... Uh, one of the main underlying premises is simply that like... Somebody last night in here was talking about, uh, no, it wasn't here, it was the intellectualist, actually. They were talking about prophecies. You know how prophecies are in, in, essentially understood by people as being religious things, right? You, you, when, you, when you think of prophecy, everyone associates that with God. But economic prophecies really have nothing to do with God other than, like, whatever the truth of God is and how that impacts us in the real world. When, when people, do not have a lot, people do not have a lot of utopian pathways, like, why owe oh, utopian pathways? They don't have a lot of positive stories for the future that are in their heads. If you want to build a company that moves for decades into the future and builds really positive things, it really helps to tell a bunch of, essentially, create your own adventure capital stories for to op to open pathways in people's imaginations, you guys probably work jobs a lot of the time. Or, fix or, or, your fix whatever stumping, please. Also, tell us about the orca. How it relates to the orca. Go on. Well, the orca is just. You asked about a tropical fish, so I, I only have a mammal. I don't actually have a tropical fish, so I started talking about myth orca. She's the inventor of the whole thing in my story. Like she, I'm actually dead. Like it's all a delusion in my character's mind. He. <laughs> no, no, no. no. But the, the orca communicates with my daughter using Morse code. Google automatically translates Morse code, and this orca invents everything. Why why is there a one thousand foot jet zeppelin named named Mythorca who can land on the ocean? Who can land on the ocean and let Mythorca swim into its pouch, and then Mythorca can fly around at up to two hundred knots? Holy shit! Thank you, I appreciate it. I'm a happy it motherfucker. I feel happy. Why is why is that it schizophrenic? Uh, that it's schizofictional at worst. It's schizofictional at worst. I'm fictophrenic. Right. That's, That's my new name. Hold on, I gotta go change the Swim to the pouch inside a marsupial. I am taking that as the new fucking punk band name. Schizofictional. Like, just don't, don't. Can you guys stop carbon fiber punking me? How about that? Carbon you're just a, you're just carbon you're just a bunch you're just a it's like you're all a bunch of steam advertising my man I, because I, listen i started my career in manhattan being recruited by advertising companies that's what happened i said no fucking way am i live no i didn't live in manhattan i didn't go to oh, binghamton i didn't go to binghamton in new york i didn't get a ged because i quit high school i didn't work fix the thumping please
I don't even know what it is, to be that. honest. That's probably him something. I don't no, think it's I him that I don't before. fap no, to I this shit. Him, I asked no, him. I, 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 please, just let me. I asked him the other day if he was, you know, going thumping while he was talking. And he said no. So, wow, that, 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 that and saying fix I mean, she's you're 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 a sensitive on. little snowflake, and maybe it's getting a little hot in here, Mom. It was bothering me too. No, you're only doing it when you're like especially <laughs> passionately saying. Okay, it's my computer so. sitting on a stand. Is it fine now? Well, yes, it's fine right. All right, now. I'll use my remote keyboard. It's it's got to be the laptop stand. I'm not raging. I feel happy. I think I'll go for a walk. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> At least like, you never made it. How many? How many hours did they let you out? I'm I'm permanent. I'm pretty much permanently manic. Is that really a big deal? I mean, I have a patron. I'm able to live for free. We've noticed. Like, how can you be permanently manic if you claim to be bipolar? I don't. What? I said I'm I'm bipolar and barely, bipolar, and that was just remember? a joke on don't just bipolar barely. bears. So I'm a bipolar bear. What? Me. What? My po <laughs> bipolar bears is just one of the silly cards in Ideopoly. I'm sorry that I said bipolar bears. Oh my god, I'm such a liar. What? Aren't you going for a walk? Exactly, hell? exactly. What is the best word? Like, when people do not think super fast, what is the best? What, like, what? Did I don't, I don't exactly? get it. Exactly. 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 <laughs> the fuck's wrong with exactly? <laughs> Fucking bunch of, bunch, bunch of ass hats, wow. actually. This is Look, this Spectacularly. Like some people hate me, some people think I'm a some people hate me, some people think I'm a funny creator. Well, exactly, yeah. Jovan, you're wrong. Exactly. You're funny. <laughs> this is like blue politics level shit. You are funny. I'll grant you that. Shit. It's funny in my case. Wait, this is who's this is Darth street. shit? I didn't mute anybody. Like funny. Be funny, please stay on the other side of the street type of funny, but yeah, I guess. <laughs> Oh, I, Hal, I think I think you would probably do quite well on the stand-up scene. Yeah, I, I've done but, some stand-up. Not gonna do, thing. but you're not going to do well on the philosophy thing. Not a philosopher. I'm a fucking inventor and a cooperative economic prophet. Okay, Fuck please. philosophy. You say that all the time, and I'm still waiting for you, for you to tell me what it is exactly that you event. Invent. Okay, we okay, we, okay. We you pick another subject. We picked. Uh, what did you no. pick? Tropical fish. No, and I no, told no, you about no, Mythorca, no, Mythor no, Aquarium. No, no, and, no, and, no, 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 no. Sorry, uh, I just asked you a direct question because you have said it many times over the course of the last two days of saying you are an inventor. So could you please expand on what you mean by inventor? Okay, uh, okay, if I were doing this on camera, I'm probably still on camera, right? Is there anyone that can see me? Because I'm not on I, camera I, at all. You mean on oh, no, I think I. I, 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 I chat. No, no, there's. <laughs> what do you want to bet? What do you want to bet that I'm not on video right now? And I, like, what do you want to bet? Maybe it's your house. No, in, <laughs> in, in, on video for in, any of us. in this stop room. In this room. Deflecting, stop deflecting and answer the question, please. No, you, you are not. Like, I'm not going to say, like, what you said to me. I'm not going to say, like, the garbage word, but there's a link right there. If you go above Ludic Interface Post, You'll see that I am on camera. I've been on camera the whole time in this voice room. On camera the whole okay, time. Could you please tell us what it is that you <coughs> I'd rather, if anyone else wants to talk to me except the nurse, like, I'm not here to be nursed, shark. Nurse. Not nursing you. You. Hey, wait, I'll talk yeah. to you. Yeah, um, I'll talk to you, and my question is, uh, could you please tell us what you and... Oh, okay, actually, I'm going to... Hold on one sec. I did... Actually, I was in the room for the video. I, the video had been turned off for a moment, but it's definitely back on okay, now. Okay, cool, wow. cool. Okay, so could you please tell us what you invented? I I uh, pick a subject, any Wait, subject. I did, and that was that was that was your claim of being an inventor. What, what was your could next you one? What was your next us? one? Uh, all, no, that's, all, that's listen, I, listen. All his, all he claims no, he invented play, are play, let him, let pun him words, play, please. which he thinks can come other things. But there's no actual physicality. Here. That's totally fine. Okay, let's just say that Claire is right. They're just pun words. So I, I answered one. You gave me a category. I found the closest idea I could find from Ideopoly, and I told you about Mythorca. I got a bunch of laughs. It was fun. Give me another. Word. Give me another category. You're not. I mean, uh, Molly. What? I, I wish you could talk about Molly's that IQ. Things physically exist. How's that for uh, a let's, category? Let's, let's get another. What inventions do you have that physically exist? I only built like two things, and they were actually made out of wood, just so technically I could call myself what an inventor. What are they? I built a. Uh, I, I built a. I, mean, I don't actually think it's. Hold on. I don't think it's a necessary. He was just about to answer. Shut up, Pogan. Pogan. Why are you interrupting? Oh, Pogan, I'm what are you saying? It's uncharitable, gun. What are you saying, Pogan? 
no, listen, you're good. he asked for me to pick a category. I said things that physically exist. Stop interjecting. What two things did you physically construct? <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, the only, I'll only do one. Um, I made a bunch of small stuff, but the, the only one I actually built. Of what? The first thing I, the only, the first thing, and really the only thing I quote unquote invented in the real world was I lived in a studio in Manhattan after college, and I didn't have enough room, so I built like a, a kind of deck structure in the in the whole thing, and I made it so that I could hide like a queen size water bed in the bed, and then I could close it, and I could like create what extra space. No, it was just it was like a deck that you know studio apartments in like Manhattan are very small, and you, you don't have a lot of room. You invented a deck. No, I mean I built uh, a, a new version of a mechanism to hide a queen size water bed and still not take away any floor size from my huskies. It's not. I'm not saying I invented the lightning rod when I built that, but to call your to, to be an inventor, technically you actually have to reduce <laughs> so some kind of concept to actual product. You, what you're saying is that you remodeled your studio. No, I built something from scratch to serve a purpose from an idea when there was not such an existing product on the market. I don't know what I you actually understand I about what the definition the of invention is. And the management were pissed as hell that you were I didn't, I know. Well, you can anyway, bet whatever you want. I don't so, think you have anything so, to bet. Okay. Betting zero isn't so, betting. It's just okay, based sorry, speculation. Yeah, yeah. So, blah, 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 blah. Sorry. So, again, I'm going to ask you, what is it that you have invented? Jeez. Okay, so that's we'll say that's the only thing that I built. Okay, I, I could find a, a photo. I don't have any videos right, of it but actually working. That's not a, that's not an invention. That's just remodeling. So could you, Molly? Do you, Molly, do you know how, if I'm if I'm an inventor, right? Say I'm say I'm an honest human being, a father uh -huh. and an inventor who's a kind who's a uh, okay, kind man. Okay. And when people are it's nice, a, it's and, a stretch, but we'll when, go there. When people who are nice to him, he's always fucking are you nice. You saying you invented the hinge? Jesus, no, I love it. There's no, well, there's a lot of, there's a bunch of ideas. Do you want to pick like the hinge? I mean, pick another category. I'm not here to serve people. I'm not the bitch. I'm not the, I'm not the bitch that's inside of Tom's box. No, I utilized hinges like to, to, to make something else. But yeah, I know what, I know what a hinge is. So you, so you were doing refurbishing? You are refurbishing. Molly, you're at a really low, like, like really You'll slow and low level of casual trolling that like ultimately to, to the future is, is, is not worth anything. I'm sure you're a great person. Crazy new thing, guys. It's called the yeah, lever. Might not be a place for you, but I mean, if you want, I'm not. Uh, yeah, I'm going. Uh, I kind of. Uh, I, I, I love and, this. And to answer your question, um, to, to answer what you just said to me, no, I'm not trolling. I'm sincerely waiting for you to tell me something you invented. Okay, so and I'm and I'm in a position when I hold. Ev seriously, I hold every fucking card, right? I told you about yeah. Mythorica, and I told you about something called like the Incredible, the Incredible, which I like. I so the, so I told you the about what Incredible. I, I told I I'm told you. That, you know, you know what else I find interesting? That I'm surprised they even allowed you to have a water bed in your apartment because usually those aren't they don't allow those. That's quite interesting. But um, anyway, yeah. Well, I uh, actually did, you, did what, and that's an interesting invented? speculation about your experience with apartment buildings. Like, who gives a fuck <laughs> what you think no, about whether an apartment building? Yeah. I'm just I'm just wondering, who gives a fuck about just, that? Just to satisfy my curiosity, where in Manhattan did you live? Uh, 79th Street in Manhattan. Uh, apartment 5, 6J, 6J. What's that? Where? What neighborhood? What? 79th I love, Street doesn't tell me if you, if you drive south on East End Drive in Manhattan, you would run directly... East End Drive? East End. That, okay. East end, East end. East end. You you don't live in you never lived in Manhattan. So you, you drive south. You drive south on okay, East what's end. What's the cross address? I'm ask, I'm trying to get what the cross address is. Just do it in Google Earth. Just type East End Avenue. Type Why East End Avenue. Seven seventy ninth seventy ninth Street, which I already 79th said. Seventy ninth is a street. What is the avenue? Hello. Uh okay uh, no east east end east end east end is the closest thing to an avenue what east the end, fuck is east end? it's the okay. furthest road on the avenue system okay. it has its own name. Okay. It's so north, south, usually, and it's next to the river. Usually when people Hogan. say that, they you say... Got a picture? I'll get you a picture. Hold on. I'll record a video for you right now of zooming in on my fucking apartment. They go apartment. by neighborhood. They go by neighborhood. It's the Upper East Side. Jesus Christ. The Upper East Side? What do you want me to say? Upper East Side. It's the Upper East Side. Absolutely Upper East Side. There you go. On the water, up Upper East Side. should have. Well, like, do you realize that we found out though, Hannah? This is not the state yeah, in which I've ever actually invented okay. anything. This is this is like a completely different state. I can show you. I can I can make you a movie in like ten seconds where I type in the name of the fucking place and then I fucking zoom in and have you high definition video on my fucking channel. And every time you actually say something a lie, maybe I'll just go on my channel and be like, listen, everyone thinks I'm lying. Here's the proof. Again, 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 again. 
and again, and again, and on and on and on anonymous. And then what happened? What you guys? What? Um, I'm glad that like this is. If if this amuses you, if everyone in here is like, oh god, I wish we could just you know vote to ban him. I'm sorry that you don't have that. Nobody system. wants that. Okay. No, 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 nobody nobody wants that. has. Nobody has suggested that you be removed. We're just finding this very amusing. Well, that's good. That's fine. Is that? Is it? no? I don't. I don't. That's great. You sound like you have a tribal tattoo on your shoulder. Enough of this. <laughs> enough of it. I don't like. You know, hey, hey, hey! Enough of this tribe bullshit. Okay. Enough of it. What? Enough of this tribal shit. You said try at first, but okay. Try bull shit. Tribal shit. It's the same shit. Same same sounds. Different spells. Enough of this carbon fiber. Enough of this carbon sounds. fiber, punk. <laughs> wow, I'm lacking. Do you have cigarette burns on your carpet? No. <laughs> I have vape burns on my carpet, but no cigarette burns. Do you punch How would you wall burn your carpet with a vaporizer? How do you? I, can I rolled you off my. I rolled off my bed. What are you talking? I rolled about? off my bed. Okay, I rolled off my bed. I ended up laying on top of my vaporizer, which dropped off the bed. I ended up triggering it while I was asleep. It fucking basically exploded. Not explosively exploded, but it set on fire. It burned my back, and it fucking... And it, and it burnt... And it, no, it did not explosively explode. And it burned the fucking rug. Explosively Explosively explode. explode. Not explosively. Like, yeah. it started to burn in an explosive-ass way. It, no, that, there's no way whatsoever. imploded. No, that no, actually. There's like, no, there's, there's like no possible motivation to attribute to him telling this particular lie. Someone just suggested there might be cigarette burns, and he like just spiraled off of there with disjointed reasoning and started word salading. He was like, "Oh no, it's a vaporizer burn, right?" It's not word salad. It's Caesar. It's not even like it's not even like this kind hey, of. You're just gonna keep lie getting he easier. Is going to like contribute any kind of social clout to him. That's why I say he's schizophrenic. I did the one thing that I said that was a lie. Of course, was what the fuck I just said. He has, he has no control. The only over fiction, the only thing I pretended dialogue. was real was the, what are you talking about? I can what are you, Claire? You are too fucked up. You, I think chemically, like you just, you are not yeah, in Claire reality. I'm, you're like the pot I'm calling the weed sober. green. You're you're I'm you're dead almost sober. dead already. Like you can be dead sober. You're like already like I'm almost dead. already dead sober. Like I said, if you say a specific <laughs> word. He starts reasoning around it. He starts incorporating into his own internal dialogue, and he has to like tangent off of whatever you're saying. There's like there's a serious mental illness at play. I mean, ditto. Of he course, has no we both we both we his, both have very fucked no up shit going on. Then he has no filter between input and internal process. It's like he's speaking filters. In filters are so great. Online. Filters filters are great. Is that what you're saying? Now filters are awesome. Filters are what we want now. Filters are necessary for a person to function. I function fine. Like yes, I, I just I make this room have headaches or whatever the fuck you're saying. I lie to this room yes. all day. But that's that's it really. That's the only problem. I'm subjecting myself to this on the record because it's fucking hilarious. You're subjecting us to but this. I can't turn it off. You can't turn it off. Just mute just mute me. No, nope, like some people actually want to hear this shit. Some people some people want to continue to look down on me, right? And talk down to me. That's a fact. This is like Trump no, as it's like having Trump as president. Everyone can just think I'm better than this guy. Let's shit on him. Oh, I don't think I'm better than you. I don't think I'm better than you. Well, at all. You, you just gained one point of credibility. So like we I estimate you up being a little bit better. You, we listen to you. We listen to you, and we think you're on to something, and then you start going off on this tangent inside your head with just associations of words. Like a cigarette reminds you of a vape, and then you start talking about the vape and the burns. It's like I'm the president of the disassociation. Anywhere. I'm a president of the so disassociation. A and I don't know that's why actually kind of clever. Wait, no, that's kind of clever. The president okay. of the disassociation. I come from that's fucking. I, I I I built dystopia. Okay, they're like all of them are relatively. Okay, decent. I'm sorry. We're, we're, we're actually getting YouTube? way off track again. Um, inventions, please. Give me, a, give, me a, give, give me a category. So anybody say a category? Uh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, Molly. Remember he said. What is this fucking know? Jeopardy? Uh, I'm making it harder. I'm making it harder for me because this is too fucking easy. I feel like I'm on Molly. It's that, that this is so easy. I feel like I'm on Molly. I feel like I'm on Molly. Like I took her. Wait, Molly. He said he only invented the one oh thing God, with the bed. So, like, Molly the drug. Asking, Molly the drug. Not Molly the person. Asking, asking for more like inventions is weird because you already had the one invention. I mean, you already know that the one I said was dumb, right? Nobody laughed. There was no entertainment. No truth. 
<laughs> he sucks so well, sad that's, now. Mithorka, Mithorka, Mithorka is great. Don't not talk shit about fucking oh Mithorka. That's crazy. We're all going to swim into Mithorka's I don't think I'll burn you. I know. It'll be good. Listen to me. So nobody wants Guys, to know anymore. I'll do a few right. if people actually come up with a suggestion. This is your chance to like pick something. You can. You never yeah. said. Oh yeah, you did. They were just really stupid. You made a I lever the, and what? No, I said I made a disappearing oh, like deck that covered a bed. I made a like a bed deck. That's all it really was. Nothing serious. I just want you didn't kill Mithorka, dude. Mithorka would fucking you put, you eat put you. Put a board on the a president bed. President of the disassociation. Come on. President of the disassociation. I have a crazy high disapproval rating outside this room. <laughs> yeah, Pogan, you must be an idiot according to them because you're laughing. You have a crazy high disapproval rating in this room. I have a crazy, hey, I have a crazy bad. high, Pogan, like I have a crazy bad. high Q. I have a crazy high Q. Crazy. IQ. No, my, my IQ is only 139. My high Q is way the fuck no, higher it. than that. Claire, I will help my you. I will help you, Claire. You're what? rich and and do not seem happy. More about the orca thing. Well, there's not that. There's not. Well, no. I, I'd have to tell. I have to tell you the whole story. Then she meets my daughter. They communicate in Morse code. <laughs> Mythor oh Mith, Mith, code. It's Mythor's code. And and basically. Why does Sorry, he Mythor's code. Morse code when he knows both Russian and English. It's Mythor's code. No, she has to convert it through that. She meets my daughter, who happens to speak English, but she does know both, and then she uses Russian swear words sometimes. She eventually gets a translator. Obviously, like this is just we're just talking about the beginning when it comes to the. Oh yeah, yeah, no, obviously, yeah. The yeah. bathosphere in the Monterey Bay Aquarium is. Listen, I've been working on this for fifty thousand hours. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna fuck this up to the degree which to the degree which Molly thinks I'm fucking this up. Did you, Did you just use a unit of money as time? What did I say? You said I've been working on this for for over fifty thousand dollars. Well, hours, 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 hours. I could. I could have. Uh, yeah, I could have. No hours. Okay. Who I, Who is this guy? I am. I am. I am. He's a genius. I'm the. I'm the Joker. I'm the. I'm on the. I'm, 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 I'm talking over him. I'm Alexi. I'm actually Alex. See. <laughs> I'll fucking Ameri uh, listen. I'm gonna do American history exercises oh with you. I'm, si I'm sitting down okay. right now. Hey, but it's smart cool. guy. You want you want to get real with us for a moment? You Dude, get this real this for this, this is real. This is real. Honesty is my god. Yeah. This is real. Sure. What do you so want? Do you want to love right now? Do you, look, do you want to drop the front and, and stop trying to get approval and actually talk about your childhood trauma? So we can sure, sure, like sure, really sure, 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 sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alex right. Khan. My my grandmother. Okay. Well, my Alex, 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 slow it down. It's not that is not oh any fast listeners. Not your fault.